Oh, it's a fire. No way, the fire went out too. Where's the fire at? Oh my god, it's on the it's on the balcony. Hold on. Wait, are they even gonna be able to put that out? Because it's on like a tiny little strip of Oh my god, wait, there might be a giant fire in the storm. Hold on, hold on. Angela, go. You gotta go for emergency. I Oh Alex! No! Oh my god, he's Oh my god, he's he's on fire. Alex is on fire. Go, please put yourself out. Oh my god, he's on fire, Alex! No! No, 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 no! Oh my god. Oh my god. No, wait, Melody's in the fire too! Oh my god, guys, please. No, 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 they're all on fire. They're all on fire. Hi guys and welcome back to yet another sims 2 stream today the pleasant view kiddos are being sent to university this includes dark dreamer lilith pleasant lucy burb all of the kiddos alexander gob all of them melody tinker worked her way in there because she's dating alexander we'll get there in a second but yeah that's what we're gonna be playing today and i did something different this time around so normally what a lot of people do is they send all of their sims to sims that are going to college in the same rotation so that they can do it just get it all the way but i don't actually mind playing the sims to university because i have a shorter semester mod which allows me to do the rotations quicker and i can get through them really really fast what i really like doing is well this is something i've just tried this time around but i sent my sims to three different universities okay so we have since the university to me is like what the kids who are smart but don't come from wealth and but they still want to do like stem stuff stem stuff mainly like sciences engineering all that kind of all that kind of stuff that's like stem shit stem, stem shit so i sent them to sim state university once again these are people who are not like they don't come from wealth they're just like regular you know regular regular students so that includes tessa ramirez from blue water village we have dirk dreamer from pleasant view and then we have katie kearney who is actually a downtowny and Dirk and her really hit it off and I like them together a lot and I think that Katie is absolutely gorgeous we'll see her here in a second so that's the first rotation I played about up to their I think junior year so we don't actually have that much left to play I can probably finish with them in this stream and then I did Academy Latour which is like the bougie like rich people you come from money sort of stuff sort of you know that's the that's the kind of university that this is so I sent Alexander there obviously because he's a goth and then I sent Melody there because I think that Alexander would kind of pay for his because melody and alexander are dating each other i don't know if you guys know that yeah they go there together and then angela also because angela is like an overachiever even though she i mean she kind of comes from money i feel like angela comes up nobody talks about the pleasant family is actually really rich like can we talk about that for a second the pleasants are really rich daniel has like a level eight in athletic and mary sue's in politics i mean obviously she's like level one or two but that's kind of inconsequential but still the Pleasants are really rich and no one talks about that at all. So that is that is that Academy Latour. And then my last rotation, Lilith and Lucy. And these are cousins. I thought that they were, I was gonna get them together. I sent them here together, but they're cousins. So my bad, I forgot that they were cousins. When I think of Lucy and Lilith, I literally don't think of them being as cousins. So uh, my bad. But yeah, Lafayette Tech to me is like the artsy, artsy kind of place. So that's why I sent them them. And then Dustin didn't make it to college. He never wanted to do his homework when he was a teenager. So that fucker just didn't go to college. He wanted to go, but he didn't have the grades to go, unfortunately. So he's living in the flop house right now. I moved him out of Brandy's trailer. He's gonna live in the trailer park until Angela gets out and supports her husband. Anyway, guys, that is what we are gonna be playing today on stream. So why don't we just get into that? I have my Sims 2 open here. And we're gonna start off with Sim State University, as I already mentioned. This is Tess Ramirez, Dirk Dreamer, and Katie Kearney. University just aimed for everybody. Yeah, Dustin, like he wanted to go, he just didn't make it in. He just didn't make it in. So I had them live here um, at this dorm. So here's Katie, here's Dirk, and then here's Tessa. I don't know if this is unpopular opinion, but Sims 2 Uni is kind of boring. I like Sims 2 Uni. I think it's because like I have the shorter semesters too that I can plow through it super fast. And for me, I have to like kind of stay on my toes because I'm handling so many Sims at one time. It took me till 22 to be able to go to uni. I started in September. Congrats. I think it can be boring if you don't play one space for sure. I only do things if my Sims want to do them. So if they don't want to graduate, then they don't graduate and they flop they drop out. The semesters are way too long in vanilla. I agree. We are currently almost done with their junior year in university. We have Dirk over here. He's grinding last time. Like 
I will say the beginning semesters are really easy in The Sims 2. Like freshman and sophomore year are really easy, but junior year is kind of where it heats up. So this is Katie. Katie is a fortune sim. I probably should start introducing them all. Katie's a fortune sim. She is currently in a relationship with Dirk. Though Dirk is, he's, he, you know, he's living that uh, frat boy kind of college life because he's still going steady with Lilith. And he's also seen Katie on the side. And then he keeps having wishes to like, flirt with tessa and i had tessa try and flirt with him and he declined it but he like wants it so i don't i don't know but yeah, here's katie um katie is a gemini and what's her what did i give her for secondary let's see if i calculated that she's knowledge so primary fortune secondary knowledge and she has a bunch of skills already because the downtownies and the townies in general they come with skills before you even play them which i love she's so pretty i love her right she's gorgeous like i i think she's like the prettiest downtowny i've ever seen in my life Something about her walk is bothering me. Yeah, this is how young adults walk in The Sims 2, and I hate it. I hate it. I hate how they walk. So, Katie went to class, but here's Dirk. Here's my Dirk. He is so handsome. He's giving me major frat boy, fuck boy sort of energy. <laughs> and he's an economics major. Katie is a biology major. So, women in STEM, we love to see it, okay? And yeah, he's got a bunch of... Oh, wait, that's, that's Katie. He's got a bunch of skills as well. I'm trying to have him write his term paper um right now so he's doing fine they've all none of them have like flunked out and i'm playing one space so when i see a wish like this get on academic probation is one of his fears i'll lock that in because this will give me initiative to go ahead and have him you know max out skills write his term paper all that kind of stuff because i do play one space so that is dirk his dad is currently at home i think darren's about to age up to a elder and Darren is engaged currently to Brandy Brooks, so they're gonna have a bunch of kids probably. Though Brandy is also gonna kind of old, and she already has like six kids, so it's kind of a problem. I think Dawn gave her a kid, and obviously she has Skip's kids, but I think Dawn gave her a kid. I'm pretty sure if I do remember correctly. And that is Dirk. He's doing well. He's as I mentioned, he's seeing Lilith. Uh, he's going steady with Lilith, but he's 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 seeing Katie on the side, so it's kind of messed up. Also, Lilith does not go to university with them, so he she has no idea that he's cheating. I think, and I feel like Lilith is very loyal, which is unfortunate. And Don gave her twin the twins. Yes, Don gave her the twins. Don gave Brandy the twins. Unfortunately, I hate how they walk. I really do. It literally looks like they're like their strides are so big when they walk. I don't know why. Okay, whatever. And then last but not least, we have Tessa. Tessa is like, what? Hi, I'm Mortimer. Since my friend Alexander, <laughs> I was about to say, Tessa is with Alexander. Tessa and Alexander were, hook were hooking up as teenagers. A strange coupling, I know. Um, why? Okay. Mortimer, I guess I'll go downtown with you that's kind of weird she doesn't have class till 4 p.m tomorrow so we should be fine anyway this is tessa she is chico and lisa ramirez's daughter she has to piss really bad too go pee girl go pee if you gotta pee and she's a romance sim so she's gonna get her on sound for sure alexander is one of her loves uh why isn't mortimer grayed out is that because she's supposed to be seeing him shortly oh contact oh oh that wasn't that wasn't Mortimer asking her out. That's Mortimer asking her if she wants to be friends, I think. That's not gonna end well, I know. No Morty friend zoning his kid, right? Not him asking his son's girlfriend out on the town. It is, it is, yeah, it's it's strange. I don't think she asked him out. I think she just I think he just asked if she wants to be friends or something. He's like trying to peer into Oh, wait, 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 wait. He did ask her out. Where are we going? Where are we going? Holy shit. I thought that that was just and casual group is okay i'm so confused um who needs a ride tessa needs a ride and we're gonna go downtown let's go to the uh sauna i guess i don't know I'm going downtown babes i'm already friends owning his own kid i know she's like walking so slow these young adults walk so slow she's gonna miss out on this group outing with mortimer 100 the sauna the sauna guys we're going with sauna going to the sauna with your boyfriend's dad listen guys it's completely innocent okay it's completely in no it's not it's not innocent morty has not cheated on dina yet so this might be the opportunity although i think tessa wouldn't care to be honest because she's a romance sim and romance sims tend not to have many morals when it comes to romantic conquests so <laughs> Dina's getting too old for him. Oh my god. 
You might be right, actually. <gasps> no, Bellum! Oh no, and Alexander's here too! <laughs> Why is Bella and Alexander here? Bella, where you been, Luca? It's the whole fam, and it's John Burb, and Lucy's hitting on John, and Dina's here. Okay, well, this is whole. Wait, this is actually wholesome. This is actually wholesome. Hold on a second. This is wholesome. I thought that Mortimer was asking her out on a date, but it appears as though he's just asking her to meet the fam. Okay, he wants to meet her in a family setting. How, how cute, <laughs> how cute, oh my God. And we have Jessica Ebody. Thank you, Jaws, for this sub with Prime. I really appreciate it. We also have Jessica Ebody who robbed the, the Caliente sisters on the first night that they were there. I don't know why Morty invited Jessica Ibadi, who literally robbed the Calientes. Like, is he trying to bring up her old trauma? That's how it appears. I actually really like Jessica Ibadi. I think I could probably work her into one of the rotations. I think she's really pretty, actually. I'm not sure if she has temple face. She probably has temple face, but I think she's really cute. Bella's hair. Yeah, I mean, she's got that default replacement going, I will say. She does not look like typical Bella. Wait, Jen Burb is here too? What is happening? Pregnant Jen Burb. Yeah, Jen Burb is pregnant once again for like the eighth time by John. John has a breeding kink. We've gone over this before. And I don't act like, don't act like you didn't pick up the Sonic setting it to be a date. No, I had no idea this was going to be a group outing. This is not a date. This is a group outing. This is, th there's a difference. Okay, there's a difference. I think I saw John Burb. Yeah, John Burb is here. Also, good night, Sky. Thank you for popping by. For some reason, there's a fire dancer here. I don't know. Oh, and Cassandra's. That's great. Okay, lovely. Uh, Morty, well, you congratulate me, Morty, for what reason? Okay, they're over here flirting with each other. Love that. Mr. John breeding King Burb. Exactly. Exactly. Hold on. Um. All right, where is Alexander going to? So, this is actually very wholesome. Like, this is much more wholesome than I thought. You know, in like, I know in Korea, it's kind of seen as a bonding activity to invite like your family like your if i was uh to go to a sauna with my mother-in-law like if i had a korean mother-in-law that's like seen as like a bonding thing so maybe maybe that's what this is maybe we can look at it like that okay <laughs> a bonding activity morty's yeah look at we're all getting in the hot tub together how nice is that this is a nice little family <laughs> <laughs> this is kind of weird. A nice little family relaxation activity. Onsens are very social activities. Exactly. Exactly. They're, it's it's just a bonding. Oh my god. Okay, your dad's one, one fucking splash away from death. Don't do that again. Loki, I want to go to a sauna, but one, I can't send the heat. And two, I've seen so many saunas, uh, sauna videos on Twitter. I, I don't think I'd like a sauna. I, I don't like being like sweaty. I hate sweating. Oh, what did you say, Mortimer? Also, why is Tessa got a full beat on in the hot tub? <laughs> like, does this girl know that her face is gonna get wet? I guess not. She's she's got she's got some waterproof makeup on. Um, okay. Anyway, so this is an interesting activity. This is actually kind of nice. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, this is this is better than I expected. One splash away from. No, he's really like. Mortimer is on one of his last days of living, so... Oh my god, Dina, relax, that's your son. Just be prepared in case she, get, she still has to get her freak on. <laughs> Some bulletproof setting spray, true. That's just a material girl, exactly. She she just, she's just got a full beat on in the hot tub, I love it. Okay, um, should we have... Let's have Alexander and Tessa go for a little woohoo in the... Can I ask him to... Come in, the, come in the sauna with us. Uh, let's see. Oh, my game. My game. Hello. Game. You there? Oh, okay. Huh, I got scared. Actually, I would, actually didn't get that scared. We haven't even done that much. I wouldn't have been mad if it crashed. Actually, knock on wood. Okay, knock on wood. I don't want it to crash. Um, ask to join. We're gonna ask him to join. Come on, Alexander. Let's go in. Let's go in. Woohoo in the sauna together. You can woohoo in saunas in Sims 2. For some reason, it's now raining. Didn't even know it was going to rain today. Alexander has gotten a little bit of, uh, you know, a little bit of chub. He's got he's got a little bit chubby because of the, the good food that Mortimer's been cooking him. Watch you jinx it. I know. I'm going to jinx it. I just know it. Can I have them do a casual? Oh, I didn't mean to shoot him. No! I don't mean to shoot you. Um, 
We can woohoo on the sofa. We can't woohoo in the sauna. Just woohoo with Alexander. There we go. Okay, come back. Alex, come back. I'm trying to woohoo. No. He's thinking about a baby. Ew, what? Let's not think about a baby when we're about to woohoo. Okay. Don't. Uh, that, that'd be bad. Imagine Tessa accepting the invite to the outing, trying to finesse the sugar daddy, and then she gets an attack, and her boyfriend and her and her family are in there like, hi. Oh my god. Imagine. Holy shit. He's douching. <laughs> He's douching. <laughs> He's a breeding king too. I'm. I would not be surprised, honestly. He's gonna poke hole in the condo. Oh my god, it's so rare. You might be right. You might be right. All right, come on, Alexander. Hello. <laughs> um. All right, can we woohoo? Hello, woohoo with Alexander. I want to show you guys the sauna woohoo in Sims 2. It's pretty fucking cool. It gets all steamy. It's just like a steamy brick of a room. I think if I had reflections on, it might not look like that, but. I can't have reflections on and edge moving because of my reshade, but yeah. I hate how they like really don't move at all and they woohoo. Tessa and Alexander have woohooed everywhere, by the way. Like they woohooed in their public dorm. I think her first was Alexander. Yeah, her first time was with Alexander. So they are very connected to each other. Let's let's say it like that. Um, okay. Let's see. I, I need to set. Okay, Coral's here for some reason. Her husband just died. She needs to go to the sauna. Nice. White cube. <laughs> you're wooing the sauna when you're wooing, and it's just a white cube. <laughs> oh, who's this? Wait, she's so cute. Oh, wait, she is adorable. Who are you? This is a townie. She's so cute. Hold on, Miss. Who are you? Can I say hi to you, Emma? Emma Steele. How cute. Tessa accidentally getting pregnant. Glad I have to catch them this room. Bye, Amy. Where'd you find this lot? Um, it's called the, I forget what it's called. The sauna, some type of sauna lot. I get I ship Tessa and Alex. I do too. I do too. Um, okay, hold on. Why is she talking to the statue? Morty's coming out to us. Hi, Morty. Uh, do you want to chat with us? He's come out. Excuse me. I'm dating your son and your cat calling me. Okay, just what is happening? <laughs> Dude, what is my game? What is that? Absolutely no morals. I'm making sure my reach is working on stream, sorry. Hell, I'm conflicted. <laughs> Morty's a dirty dog, he doesn't care. Make them do it. No, they're gonna do it for sure. Morty the creep, 100%. Time is running out. Oh, I'll make it a good meeting. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, okay? Nurse, he's out again. <laughs> he's got dementia. Oh, I'm taking off. I gotta deal with some things. He's like dipping before it gets too serious. Okay, well, I guess that's our cue to go back to our dorms. All right, can I leave? And casual group. I think that was like pretty good. I don't know where Bella went. Oh, Bella was in the hot tub that entire time. Hey, I think this was a pretty damn good outing. Everyone's catcalling. Tessa, including John Burb. Okay, love that. His blood pressure was too high. I want them to do it, but I can't do this to Dina. Maybe have Dina leave him first. I think, I know, I can't do it to Dina either because I feel like Morty is so infatuated with Dina and then he's just being used for money. And I don't think he would cheat. Like, I really don't think that he would cheat. Ugh, Morty's looking plump. Her swimsuit was so cute, isn't it? I love it. This isn't her swimsuit, but it was she had it on anyway so that was our little adventure um i could tell you the lot in a second for whoever wanted it <laughs> bella loca where you been she was sitting in the hospital the entire time she really she's i don't know she must have been pruning up in there money never fails that makeover thank you baby gravy i try i try i feel like that's my i, I suck at building so i gotta make up for it in some other skill set in cast is my skill set anyway community time the community time mod that makes it so time advances when you're not um at the lot so like when tessa would leave and come back it'd be like a different time that doesn't work with the university because of the semester system so unfortunately it's still gonna be 9 p.m so she's gonna be exhausted but it's fine we can just have her go take a shower and eat some food one thing i love about the sims 2 university is they feed you so much food like there's constantly food over here i mean i think i don't remember when the cafeteria people leave but there's always there's always food. Thank you, baby gravy. You listen, I never fell on a makeover. At least someone in chat realizes it. <laughs> I mean, I would say just kidding, but it's not kidding. Like I slay all the makeovers. 
they got a personal chef exactly they do they do and they'll make it like the moment that the food disappears they'll make some more food i actually had the personal chef sort of fire yesterday maddie twirling her, her hair kicking her feet about <laughs> this tens to millions an hour no they are working overtime hi tosh cafeteria person never leave no they leave at like i think it's at like 11 p.m or 12 a.m or something they do leave they do leave they're not here all night that would be bad if they were here all night um okay what are we doing so dirk needs to go and eat what does katie need katie needs to go take a shower so yeah she's showering these are the rooms by the way i gave some sleigh dorm rooms guys i tried to make them look lived in so this is katie's room it's purple because i don't know purple she gives me purple favorite colors sort of vibes and they cut they yeah 12 a.m and come back before him thank you glossy so they get four hours of sleep these lunch people get four hours of sleep are you serious that's crazy that's crazy wow oh my god the dream catcher yeah she has a little dream catcher in her room but yeah this is katie's room i love it it's purple she has some fairy lights as well and then here's dork's room because i feel like men do not know how to decorate their dorm rooms like straight men they literally throw random shit on the wall and they call it wall decor so that's what i gave dirk for his room and their bed sheets never match anything in the room like it pisses me off like my bed back here it's like a off it's like a, a grayish purple it matches and you know it complements the color of my my walls but men do not know how to color coordinate their comforters and sheets to their furniture in their room. So that's the feeling I was giving for Dirk's room. And then this is Tessa's room because she's like a little seductress kind of gal. She's a romance sim, so red felt very fitting. And I tried to go with like, I didn't want to like change the flooring and like the wallpaper because I don't know about you guys, but in my dorm, we can't paint the walls. I know in some art schools, they do let you paint the walls, but then you have to paint them like white or like this beige off-white color um after you're done but mine don't let me so what did i miss lots of whistling mortimer asked tessa out on an invite it was very traumatic for everyone involved what are you doing casual oh they were gonna woohoo wait go woohoo with your girlfriend they woohoo on the sofa at least like last time they were doing it in here so i'm glad that they at least went outside this time i also don't know where all of the dormies are like i have no dormies in the storm i don't know where they are and i allowed them to live here so like if i go to npcs the ban all npcs like it's not I'm, they're not banned they should be able to move in i don't know where they are someone tell me where are my dormies i'm missing them i'm missing the dormies i'm like i love the drama that they add and everything sometimes they're annoying because they'll steal my food but sad i'm sad he walks like a penguin they all walk like penguins all the young adults i don't also i don't have to worry about people coming into my bedroom oh they're gonna woohoo oh there they go there they go yep that's what's happening a square building with no personality damn they getting it they are getting it they are getting it let's go have everyone go to bed after they're done also katie this is concerning katie has no wishes for university yikes Come on, you were our girl in STEM. We were rooting for you. And we were rooting for you. There's a mod to override the default walk. I need that because this is just the default walk for young adults is not it. <laughs> he walks like a penguin. Okay, so everyone's asleep. We have one wish for, I feel like by junior year, all of my Sims don't want to do university stuff anymore, which is relatable because at my junior year, I was also like, I just want to be done. I do need a hydration check. I do. I really do. Thank you. I hydration check. A beverage of choice tonight is a peach tea. Tell me what you guys in chat are drinking. I'm going to guess the majority of you probably drinking water. Honestly, I missed so much. I forgot what happened so far. Nothing, really. Tessa grew up. Dirk grew up. You're drinking spit. Posture check. Thank you. Water. You're not drinking anything? Get some water, guys. Get some water. They're about to... Okay. We need to... <laughs> I'm trying to play... I'm trying to play a wand space. I really am. 
but I have put oh Mali redeemed risky woohoo good thing Mali's risky woohoo's don't count Mali risky woohoo's don't count babe we've established this already Malachi <laughs> orange juice because I'm eating breakfast Bre oh right it's probably early for you what the fuck Mali yours don't count you are in here too often for them to count think as streamer <laughs> made up rule for real they just risky woohooed they just did it so okay that technically counts then that technically counts if you know <laughs> if if mally's count then we already completed it and they have 50k points god damn no it doesn't make them do it again no they can get pregnant actually i have a i have a i have a mod in that they can get pregnant in university so i'm spooked I'm spooked. They can and like the weird thing is kids can live in the dorms too. It's so strange. It's so strange. Hi Mido. Hello everyone from the mouse house of the mouse. Is that Disney? House of the Mouse? All risky woohoos matter. Free my man, he ain't do nothing. Does this for Malachi? <laughs> um, okay, let's see. She needs to learn logic. So I'll have her go study some logic on the computer. This is kind of like a cheaty way of doing it, but it's so it's so long to learn skills and with my shorter semesters i do not have time to have her go and use a chess table to learn logic my nose is itchy i feel like you i was playing with the pleasants in uni and lilith was literally one skill point away from passing her senior year and already on academic probation it wasn't ruling and he wants to get more skills to save her life i feel like they give up oh wait you really are in disney wow is that serious are you are you pulling my leg are you pulling my leg are you actually in disney disney oh look she has wants yes complete junior year makes the dean's list yes yes you're in pixar rolling pixar dreamworks disney fortnite <laughs> at the grand floridian they have this piece of meat made from chocolate wait so is that a piece of so it's chocolate it's not technically meat then the only new baby i've ever had was tank grunt's alien baby he got abducted while stargazing for logic and he rolled a he rolled to keep the baby his name is victor that's cute that kid oh look the like mascots in here but i have no roomies i have no dormies <sighs> this is so annoying that i have i don't know why i have no dormies has anyone had this problem before can anyone troubleshoot my problem visitor controller it's not set up so that i don't have any dormies i kind of like the dormies they're kind of annoying sometimes but i like i like them i don't know where they are there's no bands on like any of them coming in here everyone's allowed this is a private dorm oh is it oh do you have the no dormy regen mod i think i do glassy i think i do or do i let me check my let me check my folder i thought i took it out i might have the no gen the no dormy gen regen yep you guys yep Oh, I do. I have no dormy regen. Yes, that's why. That is why. Not <laughs> being gay. Hey, that's how you can make. Well, I guess straight bars aren't a thing, right? Straight bars aren't a thing, but you can make gay bars by banning straight sims from going to them. Let me take that out really quickly. Deletes. I'm just going to delete it. I hope it doesn't cause problems. It shouldn't. It shouldn't, I would hope. All right, let's restart. No dormy regen should prevent the existing pool of dormies from moving in, though. Oh, shit. I thought they move in like the moment you start the dorm, right? Well, at least the next round I'll have like dormies and stuff like that. That seems, I'm sad that I have no dormies. I thought, I don't know, Pleasant Sims has that. And I just installed her mod list. I don't know, does anyone know why Pleasant Sims uses no dormy region? It won't cause problems, but it might not make them generate either. Okay, that's fine. Ooh. It's fine, at least I took it out now. I miss Pleasant Sims, same. Thoughts on the new Sims 4 expansion pack announcement? I am so excited, guys. I have not been excited for a Sims pack since City Living. And I think that it's literally generations. That pack is literally gonna be generations and I'm so excited for it. It's gonna be great. And I have really high expectations for it. What lighting mod do I have? Um, I have Reshade, Goopy. That is what I, I use Turnip Head by Feliki. Eliki? Eliki? I don't know. I would not recommend Pleasant Sims as mod list. I think it's a good place to start. I know that you told me that some of them are like, yeah, it's two years out of date. She hasn't updated it in two years. So. Mm. 
there's body hair yes there's body hair sense can sneak out the windows they can also pillow fight on top of beds sometimes or they can pillow fight on top of beds instead of like riding across the house you know they ride across the house so it's nice shaving too yeah shaving it's so much good stuff like it's gonna be gener i feel like it's gonna be sims through generations but better i hope because sims through generations is incredibly buggy incredibly buggy so i don't think i'm gonna get any dormies which is so sad it's just my three sims living in the dorm how sad it's so lonely what is this big boulder here big ass boulder i haven't been to any of these lots actually i just don't have enough time to send my sims to go out because my semesters are so short the max's hoods have pre-made dormies cindy had no dormy regen to prevent random dormies from spawning but like why would she want that is my question I just want to know like what's her um gameplay i thought you had i love i i do love sims regenerations don't get me wrong but i think it's gonna be better sims regenerations the scolding system and grounding system is like awful and like i would rather it's gotten to the point where i would rather not play with sims 3 the the pun uh the punishing system it's called the punishment system right when your sim like sneaks out your team sim sneaks out or they pull a prank they can get grounded but the way it's implemented is so glitchy and they never fixed it like if your teenager gets grounded and then the adult grounds them the teenager can't leave to go to school like how, that's a major oversight if you're act, asking me the boulder spawns neighborhood effects like birds oh cute that's cool i didn't know that um some sure you kids slash teens are kind of boring without generations they are they really are there's a mod for punishment i do have the mod yeah i have it i i don't know if it works with core systems by similar 90 i have been using core systems guys i take everything i've said back and shit talked about it before guys we have a dormy we have a dormy wait is he cute oh my god wait his mouth is kind of wide but he's kind of cute like cover up his mouth right now he is really cute if you cover up his mouth. <gasps> okay, Tessa. Miss Ramirez. Miss Ramirez, it's time. It's your time. It's your time to say hi. Wait, don't leave. No, don't leave. I don't know where you're going. Stop. Stop. Where are you going? Make selectable. Where are you going? Go to class. No, the fuck you're not. Go and talk to him. Say hi. Okay, wait. Um, um, entertain. Don't stop talking on the phone, Tessa. Oh my god, we have Sims. Look, we have Sims. Yes. Okay, wait. She has she has butterface, so don't look at her, but his eyes match his shirt. Yes, a sleigh. He's really cute. What's the mod for punishment? It's by uh I forget what it's by. It's called No Scolding. Sims it's on mod the Sims. It's Katie. No, Katie's not available. I use the no county slash dorming regen mods to control the amount of population so my hood doesn't get too bloated right off the bat and remove it when i need more sims oh that's cool yeah i should i should take it out and like put it back in she got the dumpy was she was she the second body type uh by the way maddie nikki aka platinum aspiration made a female body hairs mod oh that's cool do you have default face templates yeah i do i should i should swap them out oh his ears are fucked his name is holden that's a cute name wait that's a really cute name actually holden holden come on holden these not sorry i'm i'm a child i apologize um let's talk chat he has class but i'm like having him not go to class so my townies my dormies did did uh did regen okay go to class whatever i don't give a fuck look at them oh my god oh oh we have some good looking hold on we got some good looking male sims and the female sims that's a different story but these these male sims in this dorm are kind of they're kind of cute how about her oh wow <laughs> oh wow that might be the worst face template i've seen they're fixer uppers Oh, she met in the family last night. You know, she's floating with another some guy. Listen, that's how quickly Tessa moves. Like, we don't waste no time. Why is her face so close? That's one of the templates. One of the face templates. Hold on, because the Mel's right? They're all good looking. Like, they're very cute. I'm glad that everyone decided to regen, too. Oh, she's pissed at the mascot. She's not. Oh, she's cute, too. Wait, she's cute. She has, like, 
the max's hair but that's fixable anyway uh tessa's psychology by the way i made a joke i made like a current household in my university sims that i'm probably gonna upload la later this week but um i made a joke that tessa doesn't want to get a job because she's a psychology major i know they can get a job as like a psychology but that's what that's what like always that's what naysayers always say don't go into psychology because you can't get a job it's like shut up if i want to do that then i want to do that i wish my hips moved like that <laughs> and the sims too, there's a sorority and frat houses yeah i only do it if they have want to go into the sorority and frat houses to be honest i usually don't have enough time anyway with the with because my semesters are so short that i normally don't have enough time to go and do um i don't have time to go and do the sorority and frat stuff which is unfortunate because they're really fun they are they look like they're clenching what is up with you and clenching <laughs> oh he's cute too what is with the men in these dorms they're so attractive they all have like light eyes and like dark hair and they're all so why are they all so good looking in this dorm <laughs> they're hot they are they are you could also hide all the Max's hairs if you want to default them. I need to default them. I would like to default them because I will use them when I default them. Um, I'm worried about face templates right now. Like face templates, definitely. I need to get on that because I'll probably do that tonight or something. She really doesn't have a dumpy. Oh, this one over here. I think she's the second body type. That's why she's got a dumpy. If you don't know, there's two body types in Sims 2. It's kind of a, a dark side of the game there's like skinny and then there's just like kind of a little a little bit curvy and this woman has the second body like this is this is really bad this is as curvy as you can get in the sims 2 like this is it this is it. everyone i swear everyone in the 2000s was like they I, I don't know if you look at like supermodels from the 2000s that's when like the um stick skinny sort of supermodel look was at its peak in the 90s as well you guys know that look i'm talking about and that managed to weasel its way in the sims 2 that same sort of stick skinny like supermodel stuff there's more body types like you can install mods that will add more body types but you have to download custom clothes every time you do that and it's like it's annoying so literally two body types oh look there's another sim with a also the second body type bar also made a mod that makes sims go up in flames when they flunk uni it's pinned in the sims cord what Donna Lisa body type is another option for body types, but it's CC. Yeah, you have to download custom clothes to fit all. But if you have any custom body types, you have to download a bunch of clothes. And like, I, I mean, if I really wanted to, I would go ahead and do that because I do like the diversity in Sims and all that. And I hate that there's only two body types in Sims too, but you gotta like, it's, it's a, it's a process. She cannot dance. Listen, she's smuscling. She's smuscling. I guess the animations would be messed up too. Yeah, if you had like Sims Hug, I think it'd be messed up. Well, it would be messed up. You're right. If you have Sims Hug or if you're having Sims Kiss, maybe. I don't think it would affect the face though. So I think that might not be a problem. But hugging would definitely clip a little bit. Um, some of the furniture would probably be a little bit messed up. Can you be from the mascot? Yeah, you can. But just like regular Sims. It's just a Sim here in this mascot. But you don't know what they look like. It's kind of like a mystery. It's like a mystery show mystery dating show he wants to skip class dirk you do not have the grades to do that i would not do he also want, he wants to go to class but he also wants to skip and he wants to complete junior year so make up your mind my guy it's tessa tessa's a class look at this our dorm is so much more lively everyone's up here having a little dance party a little dorm dance party look at this man's name Sometimes the auto-generated names in Sims, like, I love them because they just get, like, smushed together with a random first name, random last name. And when you get two names that are hard to say, it's interesting. Demi Fox. What's her name? She's cute. She has very blue eyes. You can be friend and marry mascots, but at the same time, they'll stop NPC coding and they'll be knowing on other laws. Oh, really? I know that. She's so real. <laughs> okay, what time does he have class? He has class at... Eight. Oh, he's going now. Okay, perfect. Tessa's back. Tessa, let's have you go do some homework. She needs to write her term paper. Why is she? Why is she crying? Oh, because of the what's it called? Um, hire, fire hydrant. Look at these men. <laughs> why have I seen this on the black and orange site? <laughs> why is this so funny? They're outside of Tessa's 
door. <laughs> I've seen this. This reminds me of that iconic photo on the orange and black site where it's that white girl sitting on the on the white couch surrounded by all those um black men reminds me of that photo <laughs> that's what it reminds me of iconic photo okay hold on this is so funny actually they're standing outside of tessa's door they're standing outside her door the boys lining up though no, they really are it's so funny it's these two really hot ones too just the really hot guys I didn't even know this is casting couch exactly okay let's see where is the uh, I think I put it down here I wanna <laughs> I'm gaming all here's Maddie being a pervert listen I tried to censor it as much as I possibly could without with still getting the message oh he doesn't have a preference I think they're all bisexual until otherwise and she needs more men to recreate the photo yes it's true Okay, what's this guy's name? Holden. That's such a cute name, Holden. Holden these. Yeah, they're all they're all bi. Bye, gang. I'm glad I zoned out. Um, I think. Okay, so let's check our family. I think everyone's straight in here. Bunch of straights, all of you. Yeah, Katie's straights. Tessa might be. I don't. I don't remember checking Tessa actually. I don't remember that. She's straight, and then I don't think I can check Dirk because he's gone right now so we'll have to wait oh look at that they got generated just now okay holden is by what is the other guy oh um nawath <laughs> my bad i butchered his name is straights we have by straights no oh lesbian she's a lesbian let uh straights by I up my chances, by the way, so more of these Sims will be will be queer. Love how the computer's functioning with no wiring. Yes. Okay. Um. Let's have her go and do some shower stuff. Holding this by. Let's go. I love it. I love it. I love everybody in this dorm. Like everyone has. I wish I had them earlier in here. Um, Holden's pants are clipping a little bit, but I want Tessa to go and chat with him. She's taking a shower for him. He's really cute, actually. Is he going to class? At nine o'clock at night? He's going to, he, I can't click on him. Oh, and there's this guy too. What are you, Brian? Let's see what he is. Brian is straight. Holden is bi. And let me just make sure I got everyone um, correctly. I was reading it correctly. Nawaf is straight low. Nawaf could could be considered other or concerned otherwise. That's why I hit. That's why he was staring at Holden outside of Tessa's door, guys. That's why Holden needs to be shared equally. <laughs> the names and base game are really some exactly. Add me in the game, make me date Holden. Holden is my fave. He's my vote. I like Holden. He's definitely gonna be a hookup for Tessa for sure. Where does he live? This this girl is lucky. She gets an entire corner off to herself and look she has a big room too these rooms i hope you guys don't play sims 2 university and think that real dorm rooms are this big because i don't think i have a photo of how small i mean i used to stream from it you guys remember i used to stream from my dorm room if you watch my sims 2 pleasant view playlist the original one you could see how small my dorm room is because i think i played sims 2 back in college maybe i didn't anyway one of my one of my playlists is play in college and oh my god Ooh, was a disaster that dorm room was small where are you going holden okay um okay she entered i know you're stuck kennedy i'm sorry wait this is not him that's not him where's holden at is he asleep is he already sleeping come on holden i expected better of you is this no i keep forgetting them i keep getting them mixed up oh he doesn't want his door knocked on really he's cute he looks like somebody. He looks like he'd be on Riverdale or something. <laughs> Holden looks like any other motherfucker. No. Don't do him dirty like that. Are they on the roof? Oh, he's up here. Hi. Let me talk to you. He's playing darts with this guy. Um, all right. We're going to go and chat with him. Talk him up. You know, he is. Um, should I ask him on a date? 
I don't know. She's a romance sim, so she's. We need to. We need to be getting her around town. Uh, have you had your Sinister game closed just by itself? I've been having this issue for about months now. Prior, there were no issues completely. I've upgraded my graphics card and whatnot. It's um, it's not broken CC. That is your game running on a memory. You have to add more memory for your game, and then do uh, frequent regal save cleaners and total town resets. It's not. It has nothing to do with CC. It could. Well, actually, it could be CC. I feel like it more so be a mod. It wouldn't be CC. Um, it depends what if you have mods in your game that work fine then it's probably not a mod it's just your game running out of memory that's just how the sims 3 is if your town gets too big too that will happen holden kind of looks like goopy he does have goopy face a little bit his mouth is very wide holden is holding the hearts of chat it really is holden is everyone everyone likes holden i'm so happy we got some dormies makes me happy finals are tomorrow for their junior year um, everyone looks like they're gonna pass. Dirk's performance meter is always glitched out for me. He's done his paper. He has all the skills he needs. It literally won't expand. I don't know why. He will pass though, don't worry. Let's have him go and go take a shower, go to bed. Finals are in the morning, so we got some we got some work to do. What are Holden's shoes? Does he have weird shoes on? He has, uh, what are those? Like Oxford shoes? Oh, they're cowboy. They're cowboy boots. Wow. They're cowboy boots. How would you add memory? I have a video on my channel, Lacey. It's, um, or Lace, Lack. Is it Lack? Sorry. Lack. Lack potato. Uh, it's, it's my ultimate fixes. It's in there. It's, it's chaptered. If you look on like the bar where you can skip on the bottom to a certain time, um, I marked it. It's in the graphics card section i think if i do remember correctly okay can you go to sleep you have finals in the morning it's a visual fix fix by going to a community lot sorry what did i ask the cowboy boots is that what you're talking about or what did i say something about i forget oh shit guess i'm a cowboy now <laughs> oh did he just oh he's he's asleep for the night they're all everyone's going to sleep all right, fine. I guess I'm going to sleep too. Dirk is very hungry. Is he playing? She's playing darts alone. That is so sad. Um, can I knock on his door? He does not want to be. His door does not want to. Wait, he does not mean he's out. If I can't knock on his. Oh, he's down here. Perfect. Love that. Okay, come over here. Go and talk to him. I really want. I mean, he's got cowboy boots on. Yeehaw. I feel like if I give him a makeover, and it's not even worth my time to be honest, because he's gonna be. A one and a one and done what's his aspiration i don't think we know yet we don't know yet i'd have to ask him out on a date and she hasn't done that yet let's go chat um this is a bit bitch with the big forehead right yes oh she's kind of cute though besides her big forehead she's kind of cute if you cover i'm covering up her forehead and I mean, she's cute. She she just needs bangs. It's honestly just that hair. Like this hair, she probably has a regular size forehead. It's just the hair is just. I can't even gussy her up because she's a dormy. But oh, I can wait. I can gussy dormies up. I didn't even see that. I missed it. What did you study in college? Uh, I'm still in college. Um, I'm in summer vacation right now. I study playwriting and screenwriting, and I'm a double major in literature. Oh wait, she does have a big forehead. That wasn't. Meh. It's not that bad. I mean, I've seen a bigger forehead before in the game. All right, whatever. That, that looks kind of like a slay on her. Hold up. The shiny hair. I'm in my shiny hair shit. Sims with no neck and that ponytail. She's representing the big forehead community. I stan her. I actually guess I have pretty much. I, yeah, I didn't see the option. I didn't see the option. Maybe forehead representation. Okay, let's talk to Holden some more uh good what else we got uh do you like what you see i have a question about sims 3 how do i stop the notifications of stuck sims um i don't think you can because that's something associated with air trap and you can't turn that off you can turn overwatch notifications off but i don't overwatch i think overwatch does do some um stuff with notifications that you can turn off you have to look in overwatch but it would always be in overwatch stuff like it'd always be in an overwatch setting because air trap for sims 3 you can't turn on and off oh my god we have ah she has to go to bed i 
talking for how we have finals. I've just been sitting here talking. Okay, go, 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 go. This is boots. She most definitely from the wild, wild west. No, not the boots. Don't, don't, don't do her dirty like that. Don't do her dirty like that. Yeehaw. Okay, wait, everyone's up. All right, let's get this. These dormies, they party all day, all night. They don't stop. And we don't stop. Look, we got like a nice little omelet for breakfast. I hate the food system when you have dormies in because, oh my God, what is this drama happening over here? Also, what is her hair? What is her hair? Oh, wow. I not, not a fan of that hair on her, I will say. Star Wars. <laughs> Stop, that song has such a clutch on 10 year old me. No, really. I agree. Okay, I always get like unaudible notifications. I can't figure out how to stop it. Um, you have to fix wherever they're getting stuck and then those will stop. It's, it's, I know you don't like, you don't want to do it, but that's the way to, that's the way you fix it. Not Twitch trying to make me waste my points. Oh yeah, they recommend like for you to play sounds and stuff. I know not the overworked lunch ladies they are constantly cooking food all day all night all day all night the ugly ass couch it's seen some better days it's it's an absolute mess <laughs> tessa was woohooing on that couch actually let me let me save my game everyone's going to their finals tessa dirk katie skeet it has seen skeet i would not i would not doubt it okay let's put on speed three their final time their final exam of junior year Burn go over there. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, everyone's good. All right, everyone will pass. Oh, we're getting more notifications. Demi's by. Um, she's straight, and she is a lesbian. Jenny is a lesbian. Why? Why is Lucy here? I just saw Lucy. Lucy, hi. But I changed. I upped the chances. So. Um, we are. Oh, look at that! They want to graduate with honors. Yes. Oh, everyone wants to graduate with honors. Yes. Yay! We need to carry Katy Perry Leprosy. I think Sims 2 or Sims 3 is better. Uh, it depends on my mood. I go back and forth, to be honest. Now I'm these days I'm having more fun playing Sims 2 because I've played Sims 3 for like two and a half years on my channel. So these days I like Sims I, I like Sims 2 more, but um of course I still play Sims 3. <clears throat> Lesbian okay what are we doing uh i need to have them gain some skills right so cleaning she needs cleaning and logic i have to like the moment that they graduate to the next year we instantly have to keep them going because they're in the home stretch we're in the home stretch here oh dirk has already has class okay he just had a final exam this is what i'm saying these shortened semesters are so you have to move quick we have to move quick 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 What's your first Sims game, Maddie? Mine was Sims on PlayStation 2. Oh, who's this guy? Hold on. Oh, never mind. Mm, I'm not feeling it. Nope, I'm not feeling it. I was like, I saw the hair from far away. I was like, oh, hold on a second. No, not feeling it. Why do all these dormies have the same outerwear? <laughs> okay, let's have Katie. Katie needs to eat. Katie is our STEM queen. I'm, I'm loving Katie. I really do like her. She's my favorite in this household. Why is her arm stuck like that? <laughs> Why is her arm stuck like that? Hello, Katie? Are you okay? Um, confusion. Confusion time. Oh, Holden is talking to Tessa. Okay, lovely. Let's, she wants to ask us him out on a date. When do you have class next, Tessa? Let's see. She has class at 6 p.m. So we have a couple hours that we can spend. We still entertaining this man? Yes, we are. Stop. We are entertaining this man. Okay, so I need to stay on this lot because if we go to a different lot, then Alexander's gonna show up and it's gonna mess things up. All right, we're gonna we're gonna have them go out on a date. He's a fortune aspiration for whoever asked. He's a fortune fortune aspiration. Date the other one, the Nawaf guy. He's cute. He is cute. He's here. I like him. He looks a little bit like Tom Cruise. Well, she was Alex. Oh, yeah, she's with Alex, but she's romance. So, you know, you know how she is. 
And the other one is Macau Boy, so he's better. He's cute. I will say. Or we could just have her hit both of them, you know what I'm saying? She's romance, so um, I mean, it's not... It's not uh, probably out of her ballpark to do that. Dance together. There we go. The other guy looks like a little huddy. Yes, that's a better that's a better comparison. Okay, let's go slow dance. Let's slow dance. Um, I don't know. Where's this? I I can never find the slow dance stuff. You flirted with my Tessa. Okay, that's a good one. I trick for Miss Boots while y'all playing. <laughs> Why'd you say that? No, why? I'm sorry. Not little Huddy. He does look like him, I will say. He does. I'm in love with an emo girl. Oh no! Just go to class. Not little Huddy. He does. <laughs> Once I saw it, I could not unsee it. The emo girl is not even Lil Huddy's song. He wrote the other one, American Girl or, or American Princess or some shit about Charlie D'Amelio. I don't know why I know all this at my big age of 21 years old. It's kind of sad, but <laughs> I follow this stuff like it pops up my recommended. I'm like, OK, fine, I'll watch it. Uh, OK, go eat that. Teenage Vamp. Oh, is it? No, it's not Teenage Vamp. Wait, are we just talking about Lil Huddy or what? Anyway, so TikTok tea is so interesting. Exactly. Like, I don't even care. I'm like 21 years old, but the door is wide. <laughs> Hello? Katie, the door is wide open, girly. Hello? Um, I hate it here. <laughs> First class view. No, really. Oh, her and Holden are. Holden, her and Holden are out here chatting. You hear fireworks? I actually haven't heard any. You stink ass. You fucking stink ass. Now waff. How would you say his last name? VJ Akgar. I think I said, did I say that right? Now waff VJ Akgar. Someone in chat, tell me if I said that right. Come on. I try. Okay, I try. Oh, are we flirting over here? Back rub. No, I see Lil Huddy. He does look like Lil Huddy, I will say. She goes, her arms were behind her body. I didn't be musty. It's okay. Happy belated Canada Day. Was that recently? I live near the border of Canada, so I should know that. I have been to Canada. I've been to Quebec when I was like 10. I went to Niagara Falls, which is like right below Quebec. I've been to Ontario, I think. Ontario. And Quebec was cool. Like Quebec is like a different... It's like you don't feel like you're in a different country until you hit Quebec. And then it's like, wow, I'm in a different place. Everything is like in French. Like there's... Some Oh, they're snowball fighting. I see this arm glitch happening a lot in The Sims 4. No, it does. It does. You're right. Canada Day was yesterday. Congratulations, Canadians. Canadians. Yep. I really love my Canadian life. Okay. Share it with some with the rest of us. Come on, pizza. Give me my visa. Pizza, give me my visa. I actually would. Wait, is it pronounced Quebec or... I think the French pronounce it Quebec. C like Quebec, but it's like Quebec is how I say it. Pizza's giving out visas, yeah. Pizza's giving out Canadian visas if anyone wants a, then wants a visa. <laughs> and they mean about you speaking English. Uh, shut up, we real baby. <laughs> Don't be shy. Share some. Share your visa. Okay, Katie, go to bed. So they're almost done with their senior year. Isn't that fun? What did you stream? I stream every Saturday, 7 p.m. EST. What are y'all talking about? We're talking about pizza giving a visa. Pizza, you're giving visas. Maddie is America. Okay, Lily, and no, you're saying it wrong. Uh, America's never okay. Let's not act like it's okay. <laughs> it's never been okay. <laughs> Gladly marry for citizenship. Oh my god. Not the hookups and chat happening. Not the 90 day fiance happening in my chat. <laughs> I love it. My mom used to love that show. Can we stop hitting on Tessa for two seconds? We get it. She's like beautiful and gorgeous, but we don't have to hit on her every second. Quebec is not pronounced that way. No, I think the French pronounce it Quebec. Quebec. Am I wrong or am I wrong? Or am I right or am I right? No. 
She's still dancing. She's dancing all day. She must smell so musty. This Demi, she's been dancing for like 24 hours. Oh my God, now Cameron joined her. Wow. I can give y'all pizzas, but Visa is way out of my control. French is more like Quebec. Is that true? Not another person taking her, please. Are you, yeah, it's just a problem. It's a problem, okay? These people in this dorm are obsessed with dancing. She's musty crusty. You said it best. Let's go have her go and study. Study some cleaning. Um, go do that. We're almost done with them. Look at they're like seniors. You saying it like an American. Okay, Tosh, can you talk? Can you talk in French? Talk in French and enlighten us. Come on, don't be shy. Don't be shy. She is American. I am, you are correct. But I do know a good amount of French. Like, don't get it wrong. I do. I do. I can speak conversation, I think. I did really well in French in high school and I have French pen pals, even though that probably doesn't mean much, but I do try and practice. I would say my retention rate of French is like, I've remembered almost everything from high school, I'm pretty sure. I have a really hard time with past tense in um, like, um, like, uh, cheve, like the, what's that called? Imperfect past tense, you know what I'm saying? Does anyone in chat know what I'm saying? When they learn a language, you gotta learn perfect imperfect in past tense, imparfait, I think they call it in French. That shit fucks me up. Canadians unite. I wish I was a Canadian. I'm jealous. I'm a jealous American looking on from the border. I literally live like two hours from the border probably. Yeah, I feel so hard in that section. Imparfait, l'imparfait, thank you. Thank you. I will learn French since I live in a French history. I have French heritage. Oh, it's cute. Chaffaire, thank you, pizza. Yes, yes, yes. Imparfait tennis is tough for me to do. <sighs> My cousin's going to Canada like TV with you, selfish show. Conjugations, conjugations are pretty easy because they're all almost like, I mean, there's the weird ones like, you know, je suis. To a, um, was it? I forget. Be the sun. Thank you for this sub with prime. I forget. I literally forget the conjugations. I'm forgetting all my French conjugations, and I was like, I have a pretty good retention rate. I'm making myself look like an ass. When I don't have people watching me, I really can speak French. Okay, I promise. Not them flirting over here. What are you talking about, Holden? Who are you talking to? I think Jenny is. Wait, she has the same last name as this guy up here. <gasps> wow what if they're twins going to university they do look similar what if they're twins going to university together wouldn't that be kind of fun they look super similar actually jenny and this guy up here now off wow i'm kidding so it's not a problem you guys have to learn don't you guys have to learn posture check thank you don't you guys have to learn french i know that there's like french only schools in quebec and stuff like that Okay, what do we have to do? Uh, she's learning cleaning. Okay, we don't need to learn that anymore. You're good. All right, guys, we're in the home stretch of university right now. I'm excited. Not where I am, but it's encouraged. Oh, that's cool. Very cool. I wish we had like a mandatory, like you have to learn a second language when you're like in kindergarten all the way through high school. That'd be really cool. I was going to do like a minor in French, but i'm like what am i gonna do with this minor nothing it would not do anything i have been looking into like gaming development companies in france because there's a lot like don't nod entertainment who makes life is strange they are in quebec and paris which is like weird i never heard of a gaming studio specifically set in like that is in france but it's cool and I, if you don't know, I want to do like video game writing someday, like not game development, but like writing for video games. I've been messaging people on LinkedIn um, to see if I can find somebody that will help me and like guide me in the direction I need to be going for that. But I haven't come across anybody that's like willing to help me. If I learn French, I could work with doctors without borders. It's cool. When, what you make the what when you make the sim six sim six 
We got a long time for Sim 6. We got 10 years for Sim 6, probably. If I had to guess. Sim 6 is not coming anytime soon. Don't, don't put your heart on it. Okay. More like 20, 20 years, you think? 20 years for Sim 6? I wouldn't be surprised. Oh, Holden's here. And this hot guy. No off. I know of. 40, 40, 30 years? Never? <laughs> B, why are you watching with no sound on? I see you watching without audio. Shame on you, B. 69 years. Okay, acid. Was that necessary? Do you know that pizza has two different toppings, but the other one you can never get without a mod? Oh, really? Wait, what? I have audio. B, the chat is the chat is exposing you. It shows that little, little speaker next to your name. <laughs> I'm still waiting on Trek 6 or 7. Trek 6, 7, and I haven't seen, I don't even remember. I've seen like all the Trek movies probably, but I don't remember the numbers. I do like Trek. I think they're really good, actually. I think Shrek, the Shrek movies are very good, and I think they cut it off at like a perfect time. Okay, we got some. Brand oh, what is her name? Brandy Letourneau? Yeah, she's roasting us in the messages. All right, can we just get this over with? Like, I'm just ready for these Sims. I'm gonna put on speed three. I'm gonna have her write her term paper and we're gonna graduate. We're gonna have these gals graduate and boy. I swear some of y'all are so fake. <laughs> fake, no audio. Lord Farquaad, yes, Lord Farquaad, we love him. Daddy Farquaad. Okay, what is this? Um, She needs to go write a paper. Go write your term paper. He needs to learn logic desperately. Desperately. What if the Sims 5 ends up fully being online and having awful service because everyone wants to play Paralyzed inside? I don't think that's going to happen. Um, I think Paralyzed, I don't have high expectations for it. I really, really have low expectations for Paralyzed, to be honest. But I'm still holding out for it. I'm going to buy it when it comes out. Don't worry. I'll probably make some videos on it. I don't know, though. Why is he talking about Woohoo with this woman? He does not know. That's sus. You are all over the place, Mr. Dirk. What happened to SimCity? Yeah, I've uh, SimCity was a disaster when it came out. Like the servers were all fucked and all that. Oh, Willow, Willow Winkle. Is that her last name? Winkle? Oh, Wilkie, sorry, misread that. I don't understand how Sims can go online. I don't either. There is a multiplayer, what's that called? Um, City Skylines, you guys know the game City Skylines? It's like a, it's basically SimCity, but better. They have an online mod and I don't know how that would work, but I would assume the Sims 5 would work the same way. I'm a unicorn, I'm a unicorn. I've heard the word yikes in Sims yesterday in this game in specific. Yikes, I heard them say yikes. Yikes. I will now cook, go and go feed myself. Yes, cooking. I feel like a lot of people my generation do not cook. Those kids my generation, they don't cook. No, I'm not being condescending. Just saying, a lot of like my friends do not cook for themselves. They go out and get like takeout, which is kind of a waste of money. I've been thinking about buying a bread maker. Does anyone in chat own a bread maker? What, who, what? Oh my God, the girlies are fighting. Jenny's fighting the bitch with the bad hair. Oh, I love the dorms. I love the dorm living in this game. Wow. <laughs> Not this guy who's stinking up the place in front of them. Maybe they're fighting over him. Oh, wait, no, Jenny's a lesbian. No, never mind. She's for the girls. Oh my God, Kaylin is so mad. Bitch changer. Oh, wait, they're family. Wasn't that a fam? No, that was a peck, I think. What is going on? Oh, man. Okay, so what are we doing? I'm just having, going to use a shower. This is a grind. Now I see why people do this all in one <laughs> rotation. I feel like if I played on speed three more, uh, this would be fine, but like I'm playing on speed two and that's the problem. Though I will say I've had more Sims flunk out when I play on, when I play like bigger households. This would have been an eight sim household had I put them all together. But I kind of like splitting up because then I can spend more time and like kind of develop more each character more. It's nice. 
it's nice to play different rotations of university sometimes we're about to we have seven hours the final is tomorrow already damn we like we like, we're like pressed for time this time around i think they're all gonna pass though i think dirk wrote his paper didn't he didn't he write his oh he didn't even write his term paper fuck well it doesn't matter because he's gonna graduate anyway he wanted to graduate with honors though maybe i should have him go and do that right now let's him go write the term paper just to make sure just to make sure once i once again his bar won't expand for some reason i have no idea why i have no idea why but we're gonna have him go over the paper um did she read her paper i think she did right I'm not sure i think so yes yeah, she did we have five hours till the final exam she doesn't want to write her paper oh she wait she did write a paper didn't she she did yeah okay we're good just chilling with dirk now mr dirk maybe i'll have him do an assignment after because he also wants to do an assignment i think he should be good though doesn't it start till 9 a.m. When the new high school pack came out, the uni chair needs to come back. Oh, I hope so. Wouldn't that be cool? If they have the Sims 2 uni chair and the Sims 4. I like that. I like when they do like recalls. Oh, I made him unselectable. Oopsie. I like when they do recalls to older games. I like it a lot. Okay, go do your college assignments. What is she she's staring at the wall? <laughs> She's staring at the wall. Riveting content. Love that. Why don't you go do your assignment as well? Just have them all go do their homework. They don't have to leave. Okay, wait, Tessa, you need you need to go and play on the computer before you have your college exam. Oh, it's getting down the wire. Do you guys think they'll pass? Do we okay? Here is I'm gonna put a poll in chat. We're gonna put it for a prediction. We'll do a prediction in chat. Okay. Will all our uni sims pass this semester okay we're gonna do yes or no we'll do it for two minutes okay guys so there's a prediction in your chat box right now you open up your chat box show their grades this is dirk this is katie and this is tessa so we'll see Okay, we have to get them to their exams it's time guys it's time we don't have time to have you go to your assignments just came home from a music festival so it's not late for me to join the stream thank you small koala thank you for popping in i hope you had fun holy shit a lot of you are saying yes wait no tessa she's late oh my god go to your final why are you dancing with not off not the time you're the place and holden's trying to kiss up our, our arm wow okay wait i gotta make sure the uh <laughs> i don't remember when their thing ends we have like 30 more seconds on the predict predictions though i gotta make sure you guys aren't cheating you fucking cheaters we have one minute left to predict i think i should end submissions oh my god i gotta like do it i think it ends at 11 right that's when they end or 10 30. okay is it 10 30 or is it 11 i think it's 11. you guys you better not cheat no cheaters <laughs> I know some of you are gonna cheat. I need to end it like right before 11. Okay, here we go. I'm ending it. I'm ending the submissions. Screw you guys. Okay, ended. All right, let's see. Will they all pass? Will they all pass? And Dirk has graduated with the Dean's List. Katie has graduated with the Dean's List. And Tessa has graduated with no Dean's List, unfortunately. Wow, we did it. And yes, they all did pass. So no come on guys like use your use your you know deductions here we can infer that they're gonna pass <laughs> i would have voted yes all right all you yes people get your points yes 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 you voted no oh you predicted no oh no wow okay so we get now get to move out because everyone graduated oh he just goosed her she just goosed him i mean she grabbed a whole handful of his ass of his man ass Okay, let's go and um, and then go get some grub before they leave. Are you serious? I got zero profit. No, not the zero profit. <laughs> I don't know how can I can I have them. It was easy. It was easy money. It was easy money. You got so many points, pizza. I mean, that was pretty easy for you guys. I'm, like, I'm not even gonna lie. You voted yes. Good. I'm glad. All right, go and eat. I'll make sure everyone before we kick everyone out. Oh, thank you for the happy jingle. Isn't that nice? I feel like I should play Sims 1 sometimes on stream. I really would like to do like one of the story based games. One of the old story based games for Sims. But I don't have a controller and I don't have a PlayStation. 
Oh my god, these bitches are still fighting. When are you gonna post the stream to YouTube? You'd like to watch in the beginning? Um, probably tomorrow. Probably tomorrow. I'll work on it tonight. I'll like work on trimming it down and everything. Okay, so we are done with this rotation with this family. So what I'm gonna do now is you guys know I love my spreadsheets. So what we're gonna do is we need what we have to do. There's yeah, there's similar they're emulators, that's what they're called. Um, emulators but we need to get these guys situated into house like we got to figure out where we want dirk to go where we want katie to go i mean i want them to move out together and we gotta i think i'm gonna put tessa back in her parents house and that's what i'm gonna do so what i'll do is i'll like copy and paste this and i'll go up here to the ramirez family insert one row and then now tessa will be living with her parents until she can get enough money to move out on her own um, but let's move them out together. Have everyone move out. So I'm going to go to the phone. Can we call? Move back to Pleasant View. There we go. Do you know where I can find the Sims 1? Pleasant Sims said a video in the article, but it got copyright claimed and taken down. Uh, old Games Download is a really good website. Oh, shit. I forgot that they aged up just on the spot. <laughs> so she's an adult. Katie, yes. Are women in STEM? All right, we're going to move out everyone together. Wait, I think I should move her and Dirk. I'm going to leave them in a household together. Hold on. Let's just take Dirk with her because I don't want Tessa to uh, move out with Katie because then it's going to group them in a household and I want that. Okay, so Dirk's going to go too. He's shaking his little ass. Go age up, Dirk. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, look at him. He's looking snazzy. Yes. Look at he. He just, he just he's smiling at us. Oh, this could be a thumbnail to be honest. He's looking cute. His, his blue matches. It complements his eyes. The blue in his shirt. He looks a lot like his dad. You missed the poll. He's giving Inchon arrivals. <laughs> All right, so Katie's getting in, and then we're going to have to move uh, Tessa out. She's going to move out by herself. She's still chilling here in the dorm, though. Should we have her woohoo? Let's have her have her first time um, with Holden, and then we'll move her out. How about that? All right, go woohoo on the sofa. Uh, budget is 15,000. How many simoleons Katie takes from that? I'm gonna give Katie all the money. She can have all of it. Let's give her all the Wait, can I not customize? Pre oh, wait, does she not take the entire? I forget how this works. Um, I don't know. I forget how that works. Okay, Sims 2 PSP. I love The Sims 2 on PlayStation 2. It was really good. Also, I, I thought you said Vampire Diaries was so good. I, I'm going to start watching it because you said it's not in front of everybody. Oh, my God. I thought they were going to go outside on the bench. They're doing it in front of everybody. Oh, no. <laughs> not the entire dorm watching them. This is a cute photo. Mom and dad. Just wow, though. I've returned, but there's no food. Oh, no, Martin. We got to make some food. Um, yeah, Vampire Diaries is okay. I don't pay attention to it, though. Was there a streaker? Oh, I didn't see it. Yeah, there's streakers that will come by every every now and then. Anyway, um, all right, so they're going to woo. She's having her first time with somebody that is not Alex. <gasps> she wants to fall in love with Dirk. Tessa, girl, are we okay? Also, not them fighting each other. Just they're Jenny and Kaylin are having the uh, enemies to lovers. I think that's going to be happening soon. <laughs> This really does look like a moment. Yeah, she's a really good combo of Chico and Lisa, in my opinion. Okay, so we're going to have her go and move back to Pleasant View. Goodbye, Holden. We hooked up and now I'm going back. So that was her second. I should put that down because I like to keep track of who she woohoos with. So uh, thus far, she... Oh, wait, we got to catch up her. We got to catch her age up. Sorry, I almost missed it. The girlies are fighting. No, I know. All right, go. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, look at her. She's given very much so businesswoman. Businesswoman vibes. All right, go move out now, Tessa. There we go. Love a little age up music. So, so salsa-y. Lots of salsa. All right, she's leaving. Bye. Come on. Bella goth skirt. It is a Bella goth skirt, isn't it? The age up music has got me doing the salsa. Good night. Okay, uh, the budget is 15000 <sighs> Okay, or choose to give government... Uh, I have a no free handout mod, so... Do I just... Okay, 
I don't know. She's gonna, I, I don't want her to take anything to be honest. Oh, I'm like, okay, it booted me off a lot. Lovely. All right, let's save and then get out of here. Let's get out of here and then we're gonna move. Wait, who says who? Pizza, I'm the most peaceful person here. Okay, pizza, that's, that's Cap. <laughs> that's Cap. You're a chaos causer. You're a chaos causer. Okay, so we're gonna go back to Pleasant View. We're gonna move. Tessa's going back with her parents because I don't have a place for her. And then I think Dirk and Katie. I heard that Pleasant Sims is pregnant. Yes, she is. Dirk and Katie could be a, a good uh a good couple to put in the Pleasant Vista apartment. So we'll see. Okay, so we have Tessa. We're gonna grab her and put her back with her parents. And we're gonna grab Dirk and Katie. And we're gonna put them into the apartments pleasant vista apartments so let's put them let's let me make sure this lot is is okay let's see i'm sitting cross-legged in my in my office chair me when i lie <laughs> i make everyone happy peace i saw you started uploading youtube videos you've come across my recommended several times i think it's because i'm sub to you all right so we have a nice these this is like my favorite apartment over here these ones on the left i love these ones wait why is this like this did i put that like that what was i thinking when i made this apartment or redid them i don't know anyway um i don't why why am i having like i don't remember making this apartment over here i don't know but anyway there's two bedroom i made all these two bedroom by the way this this one kaylin used to live in this one's kind of a dump and we have this one up here. This one I had Nina living in. I think she still lives there. I'm going to move them in this left one. I like the green, the green of that one on the left. Any gameplay ideas for Sims 3? Um, I have a video of how to spice up your gameplay. Alpha. Alf. Alpha. Oh, I said your name right. Alpha. All right, so let's move them in. And then we are going to have to their their clothes are getting 50 years old if anything i'm more peaceful than pizza because i am often i i'm not here often anymore because i do dnd on saturdays ever brought your sims back to life uh no i have not it is a part of the paranormal career though that'd be cool to do not the botched apartment yeah this is this is the apartment complex from the last stream from the last uh playthrough of this did i just see a floating board i did there's a floating sign up there. Okay, I'm not gonna ask questions. Anyway, we're gonna have them go over here. We're gonna go and claim this one. They have enough money for that. There we go. Let's go and rent that one out. Thank you. And then I think it's time for some makeovers. I actually wanna see, like, I don't know what they wanna do. She wants to reach logic level six and reach cleaning level five. She doesn't wanna get a job yet. They need jobs. Dirk wants to earn 7K. I don't know how he expects to do that when he has no money. All right, let's go and uh, buy him some new clothes because I cannot with this outfit. I cannot. I cannot. All right, so let's see. As long as I don't edit the walls in the apartment, I think it should be fine. The reason it got messed up last time was because I was like editing walls and shit. You can't do that in these apartments. It just won't work out. Did I just see something? Why is the lighting? Okay, that's so strange. Lighting is like changing over there. I'm going to give him this green shirt with some... Let's just give him some black pants. Just some classy plant pants. I think he's be like 25-ish maybe. Even though he just got out of college. Yes, he's 25. Not Bella Goth moving in next door. Yeah, Bella's like one of... Because she is a uh, an actual person in the clean templates, she will move into the apartments. It's very strange. It is very strange. Stop. Buy some new clothes, Katie. You need new clothes. Okay, so Katie... I feel like Katie is giving rich. She's giving classy. She's giving wealthy. She's giving exuberance. Is that a word? Exorbance? Maybe that's the word I'm leaning. I'm looking for. Um, what would I like to put Katie in? I really like this shirt on Katie. Mm, let's give her this one in the stripes. Let's do that. Then I have to give her these sort of pants. I have to give her leggings for this outfit. I don't like that or i can get rid of these uh that's that's not half bad let's get rid of that okay um oh shit no i forgot to add it to my fucking bin no kelly stamps 
She's giving 2008. <laughs> I always move Bella into that lot dumped in the corners of the world so she can't move in as an apartment tenant. Yeah, that makes sense. Is she trying to woohoo with Dirk? They are about to woohoo. They just moved in together. And they're already woohoo. He is looking like a fine wine. Botch sign might be a sign. Well, is it? Is it really? Might be. Oh, I have to do the. Um, I gotta set it to spring so that they're caught up with everybody else in the neighborhood. Let me set it to spring. Create. Uh, set season. Season three. No, wait. Season four. Wait. Wrong one. Okay, there we go. This is botch. No, I restarted my Pleasant View. Do you not remember? This is Pleasant View 2.0. Wizard of Weather. It's Pleasant View 2.0. So that stuff never happens. It never happens. Okay, she's not a bounce. <laughs> Let me turn move objects on and put it outside. I can put it out here. Just the fire hydrant casually outside. No, I'm gonna put it like that. Put it there. I don't think I can edit the roads if we're not. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to put road pieces. Damn it. Sometimes I hate the apartments. Anyway. Okay, they're gonna go woohoo. They're cuddling in the hot tub. That was fast. <laughs> that was very fast. Let me spawn the adjuster too. I need to do that. Adjuster, we're gonna change it to a rose bush. Isn't that nice? I can't grab it either. That's lovely. So one of the entrances for the adjuster is gonna be blocked. Great. I hope they're not trying. For, they're, they're, their landlord is literally right here. Like, wow. Bad memories. Yeah, bad memories of the crashes from last time. Or not crashes, but like the glitchy apartment, I know. Okay, go and woohoo if you're gonna woohoo. Wait, are they, what are they doing? They're cuddling, cuddling, we're, we're kissing, we're making out, we're cuddling, we're being cute with each other and we're making out still they are doing a lot of foreplay more foreplay than most sims i would say looks like bob duncan from good luck he does doesn't he <laughs> he does the bald head and all <laughs> okay let's see are we doing a try for baby they're doing a try for baby guys they just didn't talk to this try for baby they just moved in they have no jobs they literally just graduated literally just graduated and we're doing a try for baby are you serious why why are we doing this dirk hello oh my god why are we doing this we want babies i guess we want baby chaos they just moved in together and they're already going crazy with it i love autonomy same honestly same let me give him some body hair because this is just this like clean shavenness it's not doing it for me it's it's really not it's, this is much better when you have some body hair on them i think i like set three i think that's my favorite one maybe four um yeah this is maybe f I think, yeah i'm gonna give them this one and then we need to do a little bit of furnishing with this i didn't add much stuff i added a separate room which is nice put this there hi holy crusader put this there um just make this I'm just trying to make everything match this house is so empty the fuck i know it's empty all the apartments come empty though okay i'm gonna do this bathroom we need a shower they have like 18k that the government just gave them they just give every every pleasant view resident 18k i guess and my name i'm trying to wonder if a sims 5 will ever come out would you give it an l no i would not lp i probably i'll probably try it um you know what i can't say i would never no i'm not gonna say i would never because i know one of you are gonna bring up this clip like later down the line be like you said you would never do a sims I lp i can't say i would never but look at the games that i like to lp like sims 2 and sims 3 i just can't see myself being attached as attached to another sims game as i am this game in the sims 3 if that makes sense like it's hard for me to envision myself playing another sims game and genuinely enjoying it like i do these two games you see what i'm saying does that make sense well, that makes sense but i'm not gonna say i would never because i probably will end up making some videos on it eventually but if i would like it then i i guess i guess we'll never know i really hope that they bring back some older worlds like in the sims 5 i hope that we get some references to like pleasant view and all that because i feel like those are sorely missing in the sims 4 and when we do get like references to Sims 2, like Dark Dreamer, <gasps> the stra Stranger Than Sim Fiction, thank you for the raid. I appreciate it. Sorry, I read your name out wrong. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Hi, hello. 
Hello, hello, hello. I appreciate it. Okay, let me put this down. We should need to create a uh, creator world, yeah. Thank you guys, London Like Sims, Stranger Than Sims Fiction. Thank you. I'm on a uh, Sons of Valley binge. I'm Mary, I'm Mary Leah. I wonder, I do wonder what art style I would go for for the next game. I feel like it would be, I do feel like, I feel like it'd be, um, <sighs> I think it's gonna be cartoony again, guys. I'm not gonna lie. EA has been doing very cartoony games for a while now, besides like the FIFA stuff, and, like the NBA stuff. Otherwise, think of like Spore. I guess Spore was like a while ago, but. Mm. Oh, it's here lurking. Thank you. I really appreciate it. I appreciate it. This toilet looks dirty. Dirty toilets. Okay, there's their bathroom. All right, so we're done with Dirk and his girl. I just want to get them moved in to a place so we can have them all set up. And we're going to return to um university let's go back we're going back guys y'all aren't using the emotes my emotes yeah you guys you guys are mostly were subs come on we got some emotes some cute emotes some animated ones too i feel like people my chat in specific does not they're anti-emote they're anti-emote i remember playing spore in the sims 3 because i had nothing to do i haven't played spore before i know it's like you start as like a weird little egg and then you have to like work your way up to a creature right is that what spore is uh but spore is very cartoony spore is very cartoony okay so we are back here in the university world we're now playing the rich kids rotation quote unquote uh alex melody tinker melody herself have you guys ever seen Melody's house in Blue Water Village? Like, this girl is genuinely rich. Like, Melody is a rich girl. She is richer than the Ramirez family. And like, I wouldn't, I mean, like the Tinker family, have you seen her mom? Like, they don't give me rich people vibes, but they are, they're rich. I feel like the Ramirez is giving me more rich people vibes than the Tinker family. Because when I see this bitch in the pink dress around my town, I'm like, what are you wearing? What are you wearing? But here she is. Anyway, so this is the house that Melody Tinker grew up with. They got the most expensive telescope in the game. They have a little toy store. Their, their whole storyline is, oh, my earbud flew. Their storyline is supposed to be that they're a toy, um, they're a toy company. Like they're trying to make their own toy store or some shit like that. I don't, I don't remember, but yeah. So this is the Tinker family. She has the most expensive piano in the game. They have the most expensive TV that isn't mounted on the wall. They have a really nice kitchen set. Like the Tinker family, we never think of them, or at least I don't think of them as like rich people, but they genuinely are. Like when I see them around town, I'm like looking at them like, you guys, you guys are part of the rich class. Like why? So Anyway, that is the that is what we're playing. We're gonna be playing Academy Latour. I haven't started anything with Alexander and Melody. If you don't know, Alexander and Melody, they got some <laughs> romance going on. And in my head, Wands and her husband are secretly related. Their mouths, like their like stretched out mouths, they do look a little bit, a little bit related. I'm not gonna lie to you, pizza. How do you play Tinkers? I can't because they're very boring. To me, that Stefan and Wands have the same personality. Um, I don't play the Tinkers. I only, I only play them if Melody, ooh, she looks bald. I know, okay, she's not bald. She, her hair is just really high poly. I don't play them unless I need Melody like worked in. And she, I think ACR had them have their first kiss just autonomously. And then I was showing these screenshots earlier, but in my pleasant view, I have lots of photos that I can show you guys of, uh... <laughs> so Alex, who we're playing, we're about to be playing with, um, he decided to have his kiss with Tessa, who we just finished playing. Ignore that. <laughs> um, where, where is, oh, so here's Melody right here. And here's Alex. Alex's first was Melody. And then Alex went around and started hoeing around. And then he woohooed with Tessa. So Alex is playing Melody, by the way, if you haven't established that. But they are currently in university together. And I don't know why her... Her hair, brand, her hair brand is always 
floating for me for some reason when I load up the slot. I'm not sure. I think it might be too high poly or something, but this is what it's supposed to look like. And then it's just floating. I don't, I have, I don't know why. Let's just get for that one. That one looks nice. I have to like fix it every time. There we go. Anyway, so Melody is really cute. If you don't know, this is Melody Tinker. This is why we're just talking about. She's really rich. She lives in Blue Water Village. Her parents are supposed to be like toy store makers or toy makers or some shit like that. Um, she had a wish to be in the mathematics. So I threw her in the mathematics major. Women in STEM, we love to see it. And uh, so yeah, that's her. She's dating Alexander right now. And Alexander, so here's Alex. Alex is playing Melody. He's dating her, um, but he's got Tessa as a love rom ro romance prospect on the side. And also Tasha Go, he was flirting with in high school. So he's, you know, I gave him a default. I give him a new face template and he doesn't know how to act. Okay. And he is a family aspiration. Melody is a knowledge aspiration. And then we have Angela because I feel like we don't talk about this enough either, but Angela Pleasant is a rich girl. Like, we think of the Pleasants being just like any other middle class family in Pleasant View. No, no. How many middle class families in Pleasant View have a pool with a diving board in their backyard? None. The Pleasants are rich people, okay? The rich, the rich. Let's not act like they're poor. So, yeah, Angela moved in. She is a drama major. Um, I only send Sims that are like rich girls and rich, rich, that come from like rich families, not girls. I shouldn't have said girls, but rich people that come from rich families. I send them to Academy Latour. And yeah, so that is who we're playing in this rotation. Um, if you don't know, I separated up all my rotations to kind of make it easier on myself. I feel like I can give it a better, better overview. Also, I love this dorm so much. Like, it is so well decorated. I mean, as I say, as I look up this giant, giant empty space here. Did she just put a pancake in the dishwasher? She did. I mean, the town is named after them. My mom. Yeah. Yeah. Their, their Pleasant View is, is named after the Pleasants, right? I mean, maybe. I don't know. Where's Lilith? Lilith is going to Fie La Fiesta Tech because I think La Fiesta Tech to me is like an art school. And she's like a hippie in my game. I turned her. Let me show you guys a photo. I turned Lilith into a hippie because I really wanted to separate her and Angela um, because I don't want them going to the same college because I don't want to make Lilith suffer more. I love Lilith so much. Oh, and Lilith and Melody are really good friends. As you can see, here's, here's Lilith and Melody hanging out. Melody's the one we just saw. She's a mathematics major. Um, let me show you guys. Here's my screenshot that I have for... Where is it? 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 Here she is. Here's my Lilith. She's such a slight like, oh, I gave her piercings too. Here's my piercings on her. I gave her a septum and then a lip ring. So yeah, that's where Lilith is going. Lilith and Angela always go into draw into drama major. I think that's so funny because they're like the most dramatic people because they're always fighting each other and stuff. But yeah, I wanted to separate them. So, um, oh, and I should mention too. Dustin and Angela are still dating, but Dustin didn't ever want to do his homework when he was a teenager. And I play wall space. So if a sin doesn't want to do their homework, I don't make them do their homework. And Dustin didn't make it to university, guys. He didn't make it. So unfortunately, he flunked out and he's living in the trailer park right now in the in the apartments, quote unquote, trailer park. So, uh, so sad, so sad. She wants to fl flirt with Dustin and dance with Dustin. Should we invite him to our dorm? Let's go and invite him. Look at her little headband. How cute is that? I'm loving the dormies. I'm glad I got my dormies back. See, that's what, that's, you know, keeping up with the Academy Latour kids. Let's go in and we're going to call Dustin. Oh, Dustin doesn't own a phone, right? Because he's in the, in the flop house. That girl looks so angry. She does. Oh, we have to claim rooms. Shit, I forgot. Uh, let's claim. I don't want to live on the top floor. I'm going to have, oh, this one has a computer. I should have. Let's have Alexander claim this one. I feel like he'd have the computer. We will have Angela claim this one. And then I guess Melody's going to get booted to the second floor because I don't have a another one of the first floor. So when she comes back, she can claim that. Dustin's flop area. No, really. Okay, go teleport down the stairs. My God, she can't get down the stairs. Oh, never mind. She didn't need to. All right, go lock your door. I hate when they like enter their rooms that aren't theirs. So I always lock them from now on. I, I, you know, I did. I made the mistake the first time people were like coming in the middle of the night and doing their homework in my dorm I'm like no 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 for sims who don't go to college i usually say they went to community college see i don't like the community college route because it's like 
in real life, not everyone goes to college, especially those who are don't have the financials too, like the broke family. Um, so I just say like they just that was not on their, you know, it just wasn't for them. Going to college wasn't wasn't for them. The dorm looks so different. Yeah, they're all different dorms. There is always one dorm in the world in each university world, all three of them. That is the same though. And I hate that one. I didn't realize it was a duplicate the last time I played through uh, university. This is kind of an artistic one, yeah. This one's artsy for sure. I love like the little lip couches. I think they're really cute. And I did add like computers and stuff, like hacked computers so that my Sims can use them for learning skills and all that. I especially think it's more pertinent now to get Monique's hacked computer because nowadays like you learn everything on the internet, right? Like you take your class and all of the coursework is like on the, on like the website, so maybe like 10 years ago it made no sense for them to be doing all their coursework on computers but especially nowadays like how i like to modernize my sims 2 game i like them to use the computers for learning skills and all that because i think that just makes sense and i really if like this game was even further advanced i would like them to be able to use their phones to like watch youtube and maybe they gain like a cooking skill when they're watching a, a you know a video on their phone but obviously they don't have iphones and smartphones and that sort of stuff um in their inventory in the sims 2 so we kind of we, we gotta settle for the uh blackberry phones that they have the first two years of my degree i had no person in person contact same um i in my first year of college i got sent back home for two years two and a half years so the majority and i don't regret it for anything i started my youtube channel during the pandemic oh someone's here why is the professor here whose professor is this and why does he have k-pop hair okay i'm just gonna ignore him <laughs> um but yeah i don't regret doing online school for two years two and a half years i saved so much money i saved like probably over twelve thousand dollars by room and board by doing my degree at home so i like that okay i don't like the uni house because some of them are literally the same houses from the game but are they really i never lived in a uni house I usually think they're Nokia phones. Yeah, that makes sense. I have a default replacement. I need to get one because I would like to get like a real, oh, Alex is breaking it down. I would like to get like a real phone um, for that. Okay, let's have him go. He must've called Tessa over. Tessa's like way older than him now. I need to also adjust Dirk, uh, Katie and Tessa's ages to be accurate because they're all like a couple years apart from each other. Um, let's go and do you want to just chat with her? Oh yeah, you just want to talk to her. Okay, what is he wants to get, obtain a pet and tell an inside joke everyone's gender preferences are getting they are getting randomized i'm on melody did she claim her she didn't claim a room melody girl come on i thought i clicked oh no i said i was gonna do it when she gets home from class right 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 okay so go lock the door have her go play some video games on the mac on the mac computer i saw this tiktok video the other day and so the macbook there's that new chip that they put in it. it's called the m1 chip i think they're up to the m2 chip at this point um but they mac is now guys this is weird mac is now trying to endorse gaming on their macbooks there's a game called uh was it resident evil village isn't that the game um village game um it's called yeah resident evil village okay this game right here apple was promoting this game to work with mac computers like they were like you guys can play resident evil village like the m the m2 the m1 chip will work so well on it and i watched a tiktok yesterday the game if you buy it from steam will not even launch they were promoting that resident evil game to be compatible with the new macbooks and it couldn't even launch like what is that like macbooks are not the way that apple i feel like the world is just going towards um kind of individual forms of entertainment for example like if you notice watching tv is a very communal activity like i there have been countless number of times where i've walked past the tv downstairs and i've like sat down with my mom and like watched it with her but the world is becoming like a place where and i'm not mad at this we're, we're kind of like individual entertaining ourselves like the nintendo switch for example especially if you have the nintendo switch Lite, very individual activity gaming on a computer very individual activity whereas 
the, the things have kind of shifted but i understand that apple's trying to cater to the audience of gamers but like just say that your laptops are made for like work stuff and just move on like you don't have to put you have your hands in all these different things if you specialize that m1 chip by the way the m2 chip in the macbook will literally beat most cpus nowadays like that chip they're not fucking around with that m2 chip it really is powerful but you don't have to promote gaming with a macbook it's just silly really it really is silly Macs are good for graphic design exactly that m2 chip will run photoshop and premiere pro phenomenally phenomenally i can never say that word it will run it great you don't have to promote gaming though like it's just silly especially when it doesn't even work that must be so embarrassing to promote a thing like that and then just not it just not work angela wants to go on a date with dustin i think we could do that why don't we oh he doesn't have a right he doesn't have a phone so i would have to summon him let's summon him over oh it was a fire no way the fire went out too where's the fire at oh my god it's on the it's on the balcony hold on wait are they even gonna be able to put that out because it's on like a tiny little strip of oh my god wait there might be a giant fire in the storm hold on hold on angela go you gotta go for emergency oh wow um wait that's not what i wanted call we're gonna call emergency we need the fire station i oh alex no oh my god he's oh my god he's, he's on fire alex on fire go please put yourself out oh my god he's on fire alex no 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 no, no, no. oh my god oh my god no wait no wait, he's Oh my god, guys, please. No, no, no. They're all on fire. They're all on fire. We can't get to it. Stop, stop, stop. We're the house. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. The fire is spreading. Oh my god, please. Please put Melody out. Please put Melody out. Please put Melody out. She's literally gonna die. Melody is literally going to die. Okay, she's out. Okay, she's out. Melody's out. Save Alex. Spare. No, the guy just died. The guy just died. Save Alex. Okay, okay, okay. He's good. Wait, what? Someone died. Alex didn't die, did he? No, Alex did not die. Someone just died in here! <laughs> the Grim Reaper takes on university. Oh my god, dude. I cannot believe someone just died! <laughs> I am I am out of words. Oh my god, wait, Melody's literally gonna starve to death. Hold on, girl. Oh my god, there's literally no food. Go get some food. Um, Alex, look at Alex's motives. He's in such a bad mood. Melody, please don't die on me. She literally cannot get, even get down the stairs because there's so many fucking people. Just teleport. Please, just teleport. Do not die. Girl, do not die, please. Please do not die on me. Go, go, please. Please. Okay, Alex, go eat some fucking mac and cheese. This kid is in such a bad mood. <sighs> but he can't, he literally can't move because he, the grave is blocking him. This is what I was saying, like that little tiny strip of land just piss yourself already oh my god jesus christ this is that was just pure she just fell asleep in her food girl really no melody oh my god you're gonna die from starvation. she's gonna die from starvation just plain and simple she's gonna die of starvation he, oh my god alex is sleeping on the floor okay okay this is interesting go and have some juice they can't fall asleep if they're having juice or chips juice and chips are the key Okay, I'm keeping everyone alive. I'm keeping everyone alive. Okay, I'm gonna save this just right here. <laughs> I can't believe that fire started because of the lightning. And then the rain stopped. It was like, he just, did he just, yeah, he peed himself. Okay, thank God he just peed himself. All right, go teleport there. Have some juice. Let's, let's get your hunger up, please, Alex. Stop. Why are you messing with the radio when you're literally about to die of hunger? Let's worry about the more pressing matter right now. Okay, Melody got some of her motives up. Oh my god, that was like... Doing that was literally such... So annoying. What are you not wanting to go use the toilet? Well, okay. Sometimes this game, I just can't. I just can't sometimes. Oh my god. Day one was already chaotic. True. She's falling asleep standing up. Love that for me. Okay, go sleep really quick. God, this is like i'm like having to pay the most attention ever right now i gotta make sure i gotta keep an eye angela does not even give a fuck can i wait how many people two people died are you serious two people died in all of that chaos i i have nowhere all two 
two deaths. Now Angela's trying to clean up the puddles. Love that. Nice. Okay, where are we gonna put these? Should we put them in? <laughs> oh my god, what if we put them in the wasteland lounge? <laughs> that's fucking oh my god, that's dark. Um, I feel like we should put them commemorating them. Let's put them in the uh fiesta no not swim center the student union there we go there we go double homicide <laughs> okay we're gonna put them over in the student union to commemorate them love that um oh wait there's okay yeah there's two deaths i cannot believe two people died from that fire wow at least it wasn't me right at least it wasn't me at the end of the day we lived and we survived so i can't be mad i'm like surprised i didn't have to actually cheat to keep him alive because i was like per fully prepared to have to cheat to make sure alex didn't die oh man and their hunger will decline very fast in sims 2 so you need to make sure that you are feeding them like periodically especially if they're pregnant which i mean none of them are pregnant but i hope not at least okay go have some juice gotta take care of okay i guess she doesn't want to eat whatever if i have them have like regular food they're probably not gonna be able to stay awake and eat it because they're really tired no stop alex oh my god they keep trying to shower it's pissing me off stop 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 i'm gonna i'm gonna try and see if i can have them eat but they're probably gonna fall asleep like he'll have like three bites and then he'll fall asleep oh he ate the whole thing okay good go sleep melody go get some food no melody she went back to bed instead of eating melody stop the ghosts are gonna roam the halls at night, really. Also, thank you, Chi. Sorry, I, or Chai, I don't know how you say that, but thank you. Yes, Sims 3 Queen, that is me. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, but, wow, I was literally prepared to have them, to cheat, to have to keep them alive, but I'm glad I, I didn't have to. Okay, they're eating, we're all good. All right, there may, be, there may have been two deaths on our first day here, but... You know what we we survived we lived through it we persevered oh wow Whew, pay the respects run their ashes into a blunt <laughs> murderer happened i got a drink no not murderer it was just a fire you know started by lightning gotta love that no murdering i didn't murder nobody surprisingly i didn't have to why are the bills so expensive here i hate how i have bills on a university lie there's probably a mod to disable them but doesn't really make any sense i guess you could say it's like their uh maybe that could be their um what's it called tuition payments that could be their tuition that they have to pay fire happened yeah fire a big big fire and sometimes somehow angela i have a theory that angela set that up because she was up on that floor at the time of the fire she was the first one to run to it and she was the first one to call the authorities so if you're asking me Angela seems pretty damn guilty, if you are asking me. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. It's Alex's karma. Why? What did poor Alex do? Did he was did he just for being a goth or what? Why did I stop playing Sims 4? Sims 4? I've never played Sims 4. Oh, like you mean like why why don't I like Sims 4? Um it's just not like there's not really any lore like storytelling the sims like a sim could get divorced and then you know they walk in a room with a nice painting and they'll they'll they, they won't even remember the divorce stuff like that and of course it has gotten better in recent years but it's just should have been happen happening so much sooner it's just not the game for me to be honest like why would i play that and wait for them to fix up the game when i have sims 2 and sims 3 where sims actually remember things and they act accordingly like they don't when they walk in a room with a painting they don't just forget that they got divorced like 20 minutes before you know what i'm saying so that is why i was so busy eating taco bell oh i want taco bell and playing some street I forgot you're streaming today hi hi off the catnip thank you for popping by hey at least you remembered you did miss a little bit of chaos and drama though with the fire big fire broke out it's the uh dorm fire of 20 22. <laughs> I got some popcorn. Yes, for the drama. That was like the most dramatic thing that's happened this entire stream. Alex has no wants. Oh, he doesn't want to get on academic probation. Okay, I will use that as initiative to have him go and learn some skills. He does want to. Oh, this guy looks like he could be Alex's friend. This guy looks like Benjamin Long, <laughs> Tony, with his nose and all that. Are right, we going to have him go and talk to him? Um. Play I don't play catch. No, I don't want that. 
All right, let's have him go and learn some skills. He needs to learn mechanical. Oh, Alex has classroom hour. You don't want custom worlds in The Sims 3. Uh, I don't like custom worlds, but I have I have heard very good things about custom worlds. Um, they're just I don't I like the Sims that have the storylines and like they're already pre-written and like I don't have to use Enros to import Sims in the town. I like the biographies and how they like affect the Sims and all that kind of stuff. Just arrived. How many more days of uni do we got? We got quite a lot. Uh, they have their final exams for their freshman year tomorrow though, which is nice. LED's not available. Please stop calling or leave a message at the beep. Before the stream ends, can we check on Ferguson? Ferguson is no longer pizza. That is the old Pleasant View. He's like my virtual son. <laughs> Ferguson is no longer. I'm sorry to break it to you. It is the truth. <clears throat> Some custom worlds have lore. Yeah, if you set them up as like a save, um, there's a way to do it. If you have a I have a town that's already like a save, you can do it that way. And it'll have the Sims with the lore and stuff. I hear fireworks out my window, by the way. <laughs> they must be very close because they sound pretty close. That's America for you. You know, it's been two two days. The 4th of July isn't for another two days and we're already having some uh, fireworks going on. This girl's cute. I like her hair. Her hair is cute. It matches her shirt. <gasps> Not Ricky Shin hitting on the food lady, the old food lady. <laughs> I hate custom worlds that require using saves. Same. Why did I start over? Um, I messed up some things with my original Pleasant View. Aging was a big one. Like, I sent Angela, Dirk, Dustin, and Alexander all together for university, and I didn't write down what day they leave on, and so they ended up all being the same age. Another thing was that I wasn't keeping track of money very well. Um, so all these kids in here, they're going to have no money unless they live in an apartment because i'm gonna have to give them some money if they live back with their parents they're gonna bring in no money to the household uh and they're gonna have to work their way out of living with their parents and of course their parents can give them money and stuff like that and i want loans too like i want to do like a loan system and all that and i just wasn't doing that in my original pleasant view i wasn't keeping up with who owed what and i wasn't doing student loans and all that kind of stuff i think i want to start charging 10k simoleons flat rate for every single sim that goes to university and then i need to remember who had scholarships um like who has orphan parents and all that kind of stuff so i definitely need to keep track of that in this because i really do want like an economic system i really like sims 2 because the economics that you can do in it so i gotta keep track of that this time around all right angela wants to learn creativity is there an easel anywhere yes let's go practice painting angela like oh, she has to go on the she has to go on the dorm room floor that has all the dead the dead people's ashes <laughs> i can't believe alex lived through that fire like i was sure he was a goner okay there's a guy streaking love that nice he's just got his whole oh it's a woman never mind it's not a guy wait she's kind of cute hold on wait come back come back you naked woman oh she just walked past right past all she's so cute jordan harris she's so cute hmm wow one time when a default face template blesses me Alex really has no wishes to do anything concerning his academics. How sad. I feel like uh, Angela would be over Dustin. I think so too. Like, I think they're a very high school relationship. Also, Angela is a very put together, like prim and proper person. And Dustin, I mean, he's broke. Like he comes from, they, they're in like two different economic classes. I feel like they wouldn't really be a good match. I do need to have her summon Dustin. That's what I was going to do before that fire broke out. I was going to have her summon Dustin and i was gonna break it off with him to be honest so i'll have to do that shortly when we get some time she's in class right now so i'm gonna have alex go and learn he needs to learn some skills he has a final tomorrow and this kid knows not a skills he has no skills at all she should go get to know that sim with the clay hair okay why are we shitting on clay hair <laughs> this guy right here patrick doss or which one who are we talking about I almost zoomed in on Melody. Um, this guy, this guy doesn't have clay hair. Ricky, Ricky Shin. He has a very sharp jawline. Do you use a lighting mod and reshader or just reshade? I just use reshade. I don't think I have a lighting. I think I have Max's match lighting actually. Yeah, I have, I have, I have match, ma blah, 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 Max's match lighting. I, uh, Dread Pirate, I think that's the name of the creator. Yeah, I use Turnip Head. And Melody go to sleep. She has 
See, she has a final tomorrow. Okay, Alex really needs to learn some skills, like desperately. I feel like Alex really would not give a fuck about college because he knows he's a rich boy and that he's always gonna have Mortimer's money to fall back on, which is kind of sad, but that's like how coming from a wealthy family works. Um, he doesn't give me like hardworking vibes, to be honest. <laughs> He gets me very much so like my daddy paid for me to be here and to get my degree like I'm just coasting along. I don't need to actually put any hard work in. Patrick was farting hearts for Angela. Was he? Oh, that's cute. How do you use your reshade? I need to make a whole video on that because everyone is always asking me, Maddie, I can't do tutorials unless you show me how to do it. And like, I don't know. Is it like something about how I explain things? You know, what's some shit too is I have multiple videos showing how to like add mods for sims 3 like smoothness patch um my ultimate fixes guide for sims 3 and people in the comment section of that video are like you talk so slow this could have been a 20 minute video instead of like a 15 minute video i'm like there's literally time there's for one timestamps in the description box two there is a two times speed button on youtube for a reason three you can literally skip to where you want to go to in the video I don't understand. Like I, I, I work hard making these videos, and then people are like, "You blah, 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 blah. like." I, I don't understand. I don't get it. There's so many. There's so many options for you to speed up the video. If I'm, I, I'm trying to make my when I talk slow, it's because I'm trying to make the tutorial as usable for everybody as possible. And in order to do that, I have to talk like I talk to my 70 year old grandma when I'm trying to explain how to turn on her phone. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, I don't know. If you do need a quicker tutorial, I'm sorry. You can put it on a speed too. I'm very much so here for the food vibes from Alex. People will always complain. I could literally breathe the wrong way and someone will have something to say to it. It's just like, you can never win. You can never win. Why is, okay, Angelina needs creativity. Let's have her go upstairs. I was one of those people our time zones are different i can't wait all day babes pizza there's a there's a two times there's time stamps i can't help you any more than i already have i have to make i have to make it as usual i've had people who are like i am so technologically um you know just not good with technology and all that kind of stuff and yeah i don't know like i i, ju I just try to make it as consumable for everybody as possible some people are better with technology and some people aren't and unfortunately i have to default to the latter in order to make it consume, you know palatable for everybody i've also had people in the comments that were like i still can't do this so even when i do make it you know as as easy going and talk things through as possible people still they still don't get it so it's like i can never win okay what are you doing angela did she do her homework she didn't do her home. Okay. No, she just moved downstairs for some reason. Um, when it's on the highest setting, it's too fast. Are you talking about smoothest patch? Okay. She wants to be friends with Ricky. Whoever said that Patrick would be a cute option for her. She seems to be more into Ricky. When it's on the highest setting, it's, it's too fast. You can put on 1.75 too. Unpopular opinion. Sims 2 base game is kind of boring. I've literally never played just Sims 2 base game. I rewatched it just because it's satisfying to fix the sims. <laughs> Thank you. I can't resist taking screenshots. Wasn't post them on Tumblr so I can delete them. Screenshots look like shit because the lighting. Editing photos takes forever too. So I have like hundreds of old screenshots because I'm still like, OMG, just one more wedding pic and the cycle continues. My, my mods folder, not my mods folder, my Sims 2 install directory. This is what it looks like. This is all screenshots, <laughs> by the way. So yeah. You explain things really well and you also speak pretty clearly so quickly and i don't know how people forget about two, two speed youtube did the right thing with that one yeah i always i always watch videos with two times speed like no matter what i'm watching if i'm watching like a youtube drama video i watch them talk their shit on two times speed you know what i'm saying i yeah i just love two times speed i feel like i'm very small attention span tiktok is perfect for me because i have a small attention span um so when i am able to go ahead and go and what am i trying to say when i'm able to speed things up that's nice sorry i was like my mind was not working i was like trying to figure out what i wanted alexander to do at the same time i was trying to talk through that okay she needs cleaning skill melody has a lot of creativity which i like 
I think that's because she's a tinkerer. She's a tinkerer kid. That's like their that's like their shtick. Okay, where's another computer? Do we not have another computer in this dorm? We don't. We don't have another. He just hit on Angela. She's doing her paper. <laughs> Thank you, Goofy, for doing that. Okay, is there no there's no other computer? So in that case, uh what we're gonna have to do is have her just go and wait. We're gonna have to have her clean. What if I have her clean up all these puzzles up here? That should be perfect. I miss the 2019 YouTube drama era. I have like drama exha exhaustion. Like when Jeffree Star and all that stuff was going down, it like exhausted me because of all of it. I just didn't want to hear about it anymore. It got to a point where I just, just didn't want to hear about it. <clears throat> okay, she's cleaning. Yes, Melody, get your skills up. Get your skills up. Come on, you need one more skill point. Perfect, great, okay. Angela did her paper. We're gonna have her go play some video games on her MacBook. Don't ask me how that works. Alex did his paper. We're gonna go play some video games on his gaming laptop. It was too toxic and boring. I liked it too in the beginning. Like I think it's always, um, I don't know. It's just, it's entertaining. But then it got like too much. When it carried on for like two years, I was like, I can't. I'm like, I'm like two years into this, and I just can't be watching YouTube drama. That's like exhausting to a point. Friend of me, this is the last drama that interests me. Same, same, yes, same. I agree with you. And also, like, I think I got to a point where it's like, there is a lot of YouTube drama, and some of it is, to, oh my God, Angela, she's gonna be late to her final exam. Damn you. It got to the point where I was like, I need to like focus more on my own life and not focus on these people I don't even know, so. I only engage with it for those Amanda B videos. I love Amanda. The only person you can't watch on Two Times Speed is Trisha. Yeah, Trisha speaks very fast. Okay, so everyone got Dean's List this semester. Great job. I also used to watch Trisha all the time, like when I was in high school. But um, I think especially because she's having a baby now, she's like changing as a person, which is good because her stirring up drama and like trolling every week is kind of exhausting. But yeah, I don't really watch Trisha. When her stuff comes on my FYP, I just don't engage with it. Agnes Crumblebottom in my stream? Wait, genuinely, how did you get the name Agnes Crumble? Like, that L has to be an I, isn't it? That has got to be an I. Tell me that your L in your Ag name Agnes Crumblebottom is an I, because how did you reserve that name? Seriously, that must be a hard name to get. Her mother era. It's an I. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. Did you look up, like, who has the original Agnes Crumblebottom name? It doesn't look like an I, so... I mean, that's pretty... It's pretty... It's pretty sneaky, I will say. Last one I saw was of Liam Payne. Oh my god, have you guys seen the strip that down from me dance of Liam Payne? It's so funny! Oh my god. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I know I always get shit for this, but I was a Liam Payne stan. Uh, he was my bias in One Direction. I like how we say bias now, like it's like K-pop or something. Um, but yeah, oh, it's so funny. Strip that down for me. Why is it kind of catchy too? Like, I'm not, I'm not gonna stream the song because I don't want to give that man money. But my last straw with Liam was like when someone asked him if he would let Harry babysit his baby Bear. That's that's his child's name, Bear, and um, he was like. I don't want my son to grow up wearing um, jewelry and painting their fingernails. And it's like, oh my God, what in the Tory? What in the Tory? And not what, isn't that what you UK people call them, Tories? <laughs> that's what, that's what Pombella says. So <laughs> I don't even know what a Tory is. I think it's like a political party, isn't it? I think it is. I'm not sure though, I'm not UK. Yeah, that's the face I made, Veneria. Yep. <laughs> strip that down for me <laughs> i um was watching uh you can like click on the audio on tiktok and like scroll through all of them and oh my god there are so many ones like memeing the dance i love it i love it so much such such good tiktok content like the app makes me very happy but it also consumes so much of my time okay um charisma He's such a freaking bore. The way that he was saying One Direction was formed around him is so funny. 
And like Harry's literally the only one that is successful beyond One Direction. Not to say I have beef with Niall. Like, don't. Oh, Lilith is contacting Melody. She's like, where are you, Melody? The jumpy is not my favorite. I actually really like Liam. I do. I mean, not nowadays, but I did back in the day. He was like, um, I had like photos of him cut out from like books and stuff, One Direction books. Zayn outsold. Oh, Zayn. How could I forget about Zayn? I think it's because Zayn left. Zayn left, and I was like, oh, Zayn. Yeah, I Zayn. My boyfriend likes Zayn, but. I was always a Harry girl and sad to say it, but a Liam girl. Louis never interested me and I don't really like Louis's voice when he sings. No offense, but just not for me. No stands come at me. We can all have different opinions. <laughs> Zayn, Harry, and Niall literally did way better than he did. And they don't have to make songs to like TikTokers to stay relevant. Louis kinda. Louis, mm, Louis not for me. Yeah, I had TikTok for a week, but then get addicted, so I don't for months of the cycle. I need to get rid of it because it's like consuming too much of my life. I'm thinking I might just like, I don't know. Like I really need to stay off of TikTok because it takes, I will sit, guys, I have a problem where I'll lay in bed at like 2 p.m., 3 p.m., uh, 3, no, 2 a.m. or 3 a.m. And I will not go to bed till 8 a.m. Last night I went to bed at 8 in the morning, guys. 8 in the morning. 8, 8, 8 in the morning. It's too much. How much longer a stream do we have? We have seven minutes. We gotta make this a spicy seven minutes of stream. Okay, let's let's have Angela and Dustin go on a date, okay? And we're gonna break it up with them. I'm so sorry, but Angela, she does not seem like she would stick with a guy like just Justin. <laughs> Justin. Justin Bieber. Okay, Dustin. And look at his outfit! His face says it all. This poor kid. No, we need to change his clothes because what the hell is he wearing? Let's, uh, can I gussy this man up? Gussy up by clothes. Oh, I can't. In your closet, you can only gussy up a sim who belongs to a family that has at least two. Okay, never mind. Never mind. All right, I guess we're not gussying up. Um, let's go and we're going to ask him out on a date. And this is going to be the date to break his heart, honestly. Right. Oh, he's, okay. That's, all right. Stop buttering me up. I'm breaking up with you, sir. <laughs> he's trying to butter me up. He shall remain unyassified. Exactly. Okay, we're gonna go break them up. Let's go and do this on like a different lot because I don't want to do this here. Um, let's do it in a nice little secluded location so the other people can't hear him and embarrass him. Do you use genetically correct because of you. Um, only for Cassandra, Alexander, and Angela and Lilith. I especially recommend the alexander one because he looks like goopy if you don't change his face unfortunately i know your name is goopy is iconic but like goopy's not goopy goopy is not for me he's he's not for me for sure the hair is the same in the sims 3 which hair oh the one on oh you mean dustin's hair yeah that's like the default base game hair all right so we're doing this at the lost in love oh that's kind of you know symbolic because they're they've lost their love for it. well dustin seems to like angela but angela's not into dustin so alexander has a strange adult face as a child <laughs> you're not wrong you're not wrong okay so we're just gonna write off the rip here um we're just gonna have them just we gotta we gotta cut it off you're no uh, how do you do it can i ask just to be friends right isn't that what i want is it talk how do you do it in some street? Is it under mean? How do you ask people just to be friends? Fight with Karen. <laughs> Fight with the Karen. Can I not do it because they're on a date? Is that why? Oh my God, they're going to go woo woo together. Really guys? Really? Goopy Butterface, what other face template? I changed Justin's face and he's so cute. The Dustin doesn't do it for me. Okay, there's like a hidden little photo booth back here. Please don't try for baby. If they try for baby, I'm gonna gouge my eyeballs out. The final woohoo. Exactly. They're trying for baby. No fucking way. What are the chances? What are the chances? You wanna live in Dustin's trailer park, Angela? Being his baby mama. Oh my god. How do I ask? Um, how do I, can I ask, how do I break up with this man? 
lover's goodbye to unwanted pregnancy storyline. I just don't want you anymore. We've grown apart as people, Dustin. Isn't it under... I swear to God, I've seen like an ass just to be friends thingy. Just, um... Irritate, argue. All right, let's argue. No, don't leave. Okay, don't leave yet. Dustin, stop. Argue. Stop. Where are you going? Get over here. I think you need to fight. I think you're right. I think we need to tussle with him. Dustin, come here. I have like a piece of hair in my eyeball. Ugh! Argue. Go argue. Dude, she got it. Why is she trying for a baby? You're in college. You are a freshman. Dustin, stop. Where are you going? Stop leaving. Irritate. Argue. Stop leaving. Stop. Stop. Dustin. He's he will not stop leaving. He's he's gone. He just wants to leave. He wants to marry Rich Sim, in fact. Okay, bye, Dustin. Goodbye. Well, that was sad. Can't break up without doing things to drive the relationship down, like cheating, etc. There's a mod that lets you. How does the mod let you work? Oh, I need that. I definitely need that. Are you sure that I don't have the mod? I don't have the mod to let them um break up anytime. No, I don't have that. I should get that though. Allows you to you to, I, I swear I have the one that allows you. Maybe that's in Sims 3 I'm thinking of. I'm, I thought I had the one in Sims 2 though. I definitely need it though. I need it. Okay, well that was a flop. All I got from that was a try for a baby with Angela who is in college trying to get pregnant. Please no, please. I need, I need that not to be a thing. If they let you do like in-home university, in sims 2 that would be simply the most iconic thing you know the mod you can keep arguing yeah i have to keep arguing with dustin i might have to keep arguing with him okay we're gonna summon him back over let's just pretend uh you know we just we just uh invited him back to our place i guess all right irritate argue let's go and argue with him let's go fight with him that seems like kind of an oversight to not have out of that you need a mod? Wait, if I don't argue with him, will that not work? Okay, argue. Wait, you're stupid. You're broke. You're stupid. You're broke. Argue. Argue. I'm classist. I hate you. <laughs> I hate you. Okay, wait. That's that's it's taking too long. All right, whatever. I give up. Leave me alone, Dustin. Leave me alone. All right, we'll do that. I'll have to do that like off camera because I don't want them to be together anymore. I feel like she can move on. I feel like Angela and Alex might be a good pair actually might be cute they're both rich you can cheat it with the life of death oh can you i think I'll, yeah i'll i'll um i'll definitely download that mod and we can break them up that way but okay well i think i'm gonna end stream there guys we played two college rotations and i'm honestly very proud of that i'm proud of our uh, college rotation spring sims bestie are you kidding me I was about to end Spring Sims. <laughs> no way. No way. What is that timing? What is that timing? What if we pass it off to somebody else? Let's see who else we got. Wow. I literally can't believe that. The timing on that. You couldn't have done it five minutes earlier, Spring Sims. Okay, do I have any friends streaming? Um, how about Sims 3? Do I have any Sims 3? Perfect timing, I know. Just wow. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. I don't see any of my friends streaming. Oh man. Oh man. Hmm. Trying to. I'm trying to choose. Um. Should we just pick someone from Sims 3? Does anybody have any friend they have streaming? We could. Let's pass. Why don't we pass it off to them? I have it to me all the time, I know, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> really? Like at the end of stream. Okay, what if we what if we do MK Becca? Should we do that? They're playing Sims 3 right now. I like I do quite like the Sims 3. Okay guys, let's go raid them. Thank you. You like my top? It's a dress. Okay, let's do can I do a slash raid? Okay, there we go. Alright, guys, let's go. Alright, come on guys, let's go, let's go raid. MK Becca, we're going over there. Alright, bye guys. I will see you all next Saturday. We're raiding. We're raiding right now. Everyone, let's gear up. Gear up for a raid. Next Saturday, I'll be live again, though. 7 p.m. EST. You better be there or be square. Okay? Double raid hype. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I have to end stream. Okay, here we go. Bye, guys.